Welcome to the Fantasy Audiobook. Fantasy. Sign in for a thousand years at the start. Chapter 1. Song Wudao, you will join the refining mountain in the future and be a refining attendant. The indifferent voice sounded smoothly in the great hall. The bustling disciples below were quiet. People turned their eyes to a bleak-faced teenager, showing some sympathy. This is an ordinary-looking teenager. At this time, facing the Taoist, who is an elder, the young man's eyes were firmly closed, and he looked a little ignorant. It's just that no one thinks this is a problem. Because they knew that Song Wudao was blind. Okay. Song Wudao nodded and did not speak any more. Silently accepted sex assignment. It's so pitiful, this Song Wudao. He was born with a natural disability, and his parents died in the riots of demons. What's more unfortunate is that he was found to have no talent at the Kixian meeting. This person is over. Quote. When someone in the crowd noticed Song Wudao, there was a look of pity in their eyes, and they kept shaking their heads. There is something wrong with this, Brother Wong. Someone in the crowd disagreed. Although it is far away from the main road to be a military attendant, it is also a pretty good job. You can get a lot of money on weekdays. If it weren't for the sacrifice of Song Wudao's parents for sect, sect would probably not arrange for someone without talent. The blind man went to serve as a military attendant. Although it's a hard work to be a military attendant, Shanlu is hopeless. There is nothing wrong with other things. The person speaking has narrow noses, and his neck is slightly tilted up, seeming to be quite content with what he is saying. He felt that Song Wudao was able to get such a position, and it could be said that it was a great way out. Brother Chu is right. Someone next to him agreed and said that there was both sympathy for Song Wudao and despised Song Wudao's lack of talent. This is after all a Qi Yuan Qi, the weaker like ants, and the stronger wantonly. As the disciples of the super grade sect Tianhe sect, they may all become masters in the future. Who is not fascinated by being able to take advantage of the wind and protect the air and enjoy the world? And Song Wudao, who became a refining attendant, was destined not to have too much intersection with them. Everyone knows that the training divisions of Refining Mountain are not only easily disturbed by fire, but also have a lot of affairs. For a long time, there have been fewer and fewer refining divisions in Refining Mountain, and no one is willing to enter the line of Refining Mountain. Song Wudao closed his eyes. He was born with an eye disease. His ears were naturally extremely sensitive, and he could easily hear the words around him. At this moment, his heart couldn't help feeling lost. This eye disease has been with the second life, even after he travels to this world, the situation still has not changed. As a natural disabled person, a blind person in other populations. Even though I have been accustomed to such a life for many years, I still have a kind of hope in my heart. What if, this is a world of immortals, let alone the treatment of eye diseases, goodbye to the light, it is the rumors of broken arms and legs, the heart was beaten and then healed, it is also everywhere in this world. So since he was born in the Tianhe sect, he has been looking forward to the enlightenment meeting at the age of 14, hoping that he can have enough outstanding talents to practice smoothly all the way. Only, my talent is so bad. God, why did you treat me like this when you let me come into this strange world? Song Wudao could no longer listen to the crowd's comments on him, and his usual tranquil heart was in a mess. After a long while, Song Wudao followed his guide to refining Soldier Mountain where the fire was overflowing and occasionally a red light rose chaotically. Song Wudao, you can live in Lianbing Mountain first, said the brother who led the way. Master Yan from Refining Soldier Mountain recently went out looking for materials, and he will come to you when he comes back. After saying this, and after giving him more instructions, the senior brother left. After a long sigh sounded in the air, Song Wudao had to slow down and prepare for the next life. Things have been like this, so consider for the next life. Unlucky Song Wudao has become accustomed to dealing with such things. He knew that no matter how bad he was, no one else would care. If you follow your emotions, unfortunately, you may end up with yourself. Forget it, at least listen to them. Being a military attendant is not a bad thing, except for getting tired. Song Wudao comforted himself. Song Wudao was right. In such a big sect, there will always be many people using weapons. In fact, the refining attendants and refining divisions received very good treatment in the Tianhe sect. 
Although it is not conducive to spiritual practice, it is also a bit hard on weekdays, but the benefits are not small. Ding. Just as Song Wudao was thinking about his future life, a sweet voice suddenly came from his ear. The God level sign in system is activating. Activated. The system automatically binds. Binding is complete. The feminine voice rang in Song Wudao's ears, making him startled. With his eyes closed, he couldn't help but open his mouth, looking a little surprised. System. Is it because he is a traverser? He really didn't expect that he would awaken the system when he was so unlucky. This is real. System, introduce your abilities. Song Wudao tentatively asked. Dear host, this system is called a god level sign in system. The host only needs to sign in at any place, and he has the opportunity to have the opportunity to have karma here. The sound of the ear system came, explaining its own function to its owner. In the next second, Song Wudao understood how to use it. Where there is chance, he only needs to sign in. Opportunity. What kind of opportunity can you get? Even though Song Wudao was steadfast in the world, he couldn't help but be puzzled and his heart warmed up. But he didn't ask. After all, it was better to do it. He immediately said to the system, System, can you sign in at Lianbing Mountain? The hot wind flowing around Song Wudao bake him, should he be able to sign in on the mountain where he is located? What chance can I get when signing in at Lianbingshan? Why doesn't the system answer him? Ding. When Song Wudao was secretly worried, the voice of the system suddenly rang in his ears. Congratulations to the host. The host has successfully signed in and got the chance to use the Galaxy Cluster Swordsmanship. Song Wudao was very happy. Just now he was still worried about whether the system could understand him, but he didn't expect the system to respond immediately. At the same time, an indescribable strange feeling filled Song Wudao's mind. In the faint world, a piece of gold suddenly appeared, as if paper made of sacred iron. The paper is full of magic, generally occupying Song Wudao's entire mind. The top of the paper is densely engraved with profound and mysterious words. The words are very mysterious. Even if Song Wudao doesn't recognize such words, he can easily understand the contents of the paper. Star, River, Sword, Gong. After reading the first four words, Song Wudao seemed to miss a beat in his heartbeat. Galaxy Cluster Sword Art, a peerless Taoist from the heavens. Through the words on the gold paper, Song Wudao quickly learned where the Galaxy Cluster Sword skills came from. It belongs to the heavens. Since Song Wudao came to this world, he has already known the difference in this world of Shenxia, and he can no longer look at it in the way he used to know it. In the Tianhe sect, he had heard of it in those myths and legends that seemed true or false. A common existence. Skyline. It is said that the monk can only ascend to the realm of legend after breaking through the highest realm. As for the cultivation technique belonging to the celestial realm, he got it after simply signing in. Song Wudao couldn't believe it. This is just like a dream. No, this is dreaming. It's just that when he looked at the golden paper in his mind, he understood deeply. This is true, this is not a dream. A fascinating feeling emerged from Song Wudao's body, cyclically in his meridians, and gradually covered his entire body. Song Wudao felt the sound of something being shattered in his body, and an extremely powerful vitality was generated from his body, and it spontaneously began to grow. This, this galaxy cluster knife skill is really amazing, it can run on its own in the body. And, Song Wudao was inexplicably surprised. My body is changing. This cultivation technique can actually change my cultivation talent. Unbelievable. It's amazing. I just tested it at the Enlightenment Conference. My talent is not capable of cultivating a high-level cultivation technique, but I can easily cultivate this cultivation technique. It's worthy of being a peerless Taoist from the heavens. Song Wudao held his breath. He clenched his fist and opened it again, and he felt his body stronger than ever. In just a short moment, I have already entered the metamorphosis realm. He didn't know much about cultivation, because his parents died earlier, so he didn't know much. These realm, Kaiyuan, Transcendence, Condensate, Foundation Building, Shanpu, Gold Core, Dongshuan. Each realm is also divided into nine small realms. It is said that as long as you reach the Gold Core state, there is a chance for your body to transform and repair your body. With the system, it should be possible to cure my eye disease, right? 
Song Wudao's calm heart fluctuates, raising a lot of expectations. With anticipation, and the novelty of obtaining treasures, he was immersed in his own harvest, constantly cultivating the galaxy cluster sword skills he had just obtained, tirelessly like a cow. Ding! Congratulations to the host, the host has successfully signed in and obtained the opportunity to raise the original pill. Ding! Congratulations to the host, the host has successfully signed in and obtained the chance for the mysterious iron stone. Ding! Time passed by like a white horse, and Song Wudao insisted on cultivation and signing in every day. Every day, although the chances of signing in are not as good as the first time, it still makes ordinary practitioners jealous and crazy. Countless treasures were easily obtained by Song Wudao. One day, only the last brilliance is left at dusk, and the world is about to plunge into darkness. A strong old man with white beard and hair walked towards the mountain from a distance. After cultivation, Song Wudao, who had undergone earth-shaking changes, discovered the arrival of outsiders when the old man approached Lianbing Mountain. After a while, the old man came to Song Wudao. Song Wudao. It's a poor child. Since you have been assigned to the mountain of my army, you are destined to me, and I will treat you well. Let's go, follow me behind. After speaking, the old man turned around and led Song Wudao into a place in Lianbing Mountain. Over the past dynasties, Tianhe sect has a total of nine casting chambers in Lianbingshan. Each casting room has a different mystery. The place in front is used for smelting stone and quenching iron. Song Wudao followed the old man's lead, and the air in midair became hotter, but this had no effect on Song Wudao after cultivation. Although he still can't see the world now. But his other senses, which were already extremely good, became extremely exaggerated after the baptism of cultivation, which was far more comparable. The flames in the casting room are hot, and the energy of the flames is very easy to invade mortals. This is for you, don't let it leave your side. The old man explained to Song Wudao that he also gave Song Wudao a jade card with a warm and cool hand. Thanks. The moment Song Wudao received the jade card, a cool feeling began to fill his whole body, making Song Wudao no longer feel the heat. Song Wudao, who was accustomed to seeing treasures, immediately understood after taking over. This is a treasure. In fact, since his cultivation, he has long since been afraid of the erosion of anger, but Song Wudao still took the jade card. It is better not to be noticed by his system. He has just been cultivating for a short time, but he can't attract the wolves outside because of his pride and showing off his strength. As a blind man with no talent, accepting arrangements is what he should have. Call me Yan Lao, the old man said to Song Wudao. The front is the most important part of this casting room. Golden Pool. Old Yan led Song Wudao into the casting room. In front of them, there was a round pool containing red magma, and there was a layer of golden floating objects on the surface of the pool. The water in the round pool kept surging, and occasionally there was the sound of bubbles bursting. These bright red pools with golden floating objects are beautiful and extremely dangerous. A little closer can turn unprotected mortals into ashes. Next to him, Yan Lao brought a heavy ore with black and brown color. Puff! After a very dull sound, the ore was thrown into the golden pond by Yan Lao. Since today, you have thrown 80 pieces of profound iron ore into the golden pond every day. After they melt, you use the formula I taught you to collect the iron essence with the jade metal, and you have completed the work. Old Yan did not say anything else, but arranged work for Song Wudao. In the casting room, the two stayed for another hour, Yan Lao and Song Wudao talked a lot about the conditions and rules of the casting room. Suddenly, the water in the golden pond surged violently. Old Yan looked at Jin Kai. The old fingers drew a track in the air, and the jade card automatically flew into the air. Do you understand what I just said? Old Yan said to Song Wudao. A golden red iron slurry in the golden pond flew into the jade metal. Obviously, this gold red iron slurry is iron concentrate extracted from iron ore. Understood. Song Wudao agreed that other people had said that it was very hard to be a military attendant, but now it seems that this job is not hard, nor is it tiring. Take it easy, child. In the jade metal I gave you there is the forging technique used by our military trainer cultivation, you can feel it with your heart. Although it can only be cultivated to the transcendence realm, it can be regarded as okay. As long as you become the pinnacle of Houdian someday, I will teach you to train your troops and become a trainer. 
Elder Yan said a few more words, probably because he was a lonely blind man, and sympathized with him more. Thank you Yan Lao. Song Wudao felt this intention and thanked the old man Yan. Then I'll leave first. I have a lot of work to do when I come back this time. You are cultivating well here, and there will be something for you to help in the future. After speaking, Yan Lao left. When Yan Lao walked away, Song Wudao showed a relaxed smile. He moved his fingers, and a piece of profound iron ore flew over. Weighing a considerable amount of iron ore. If before his cultivation, moving 80 pieces of iron ore into the golden pond every day, it would definitely take a lot of effort. But now, this matter couldn't be easier. Go ahead. He waved. A kind of magical power suddenly appeared, like a lot of transparent wrestlers appeared out of thin air, and the black and brown iron ore was moved into the air one after another. Puff, puff, the sound inside the caster is continuous. Pieces of profound iron ore were easily thrown into the golden red pool by Song Wudao. All right, just collect the iron essence in an hour. Song Wudao smiled easily. The cultivation started directly in the casting chamber. The casting room is remote, and no one comes to it on weekdays. Even if someone comes over, relying on his realm, which is nine-tiered, and the keen senses that surpass ordinary people. When a person comes, he can easily sense it. Refining Soldier Mountain, time is fleeting, and a year has passed very quickly. Ding! Congratulations to the host, the host has successfully signed in, and got the chance to lose saber technique. Ding! Congratulations to the host. In the past year, Song Wudao's cultivation base has made great progress, and it has reached the ninth level of condensate. Because of the frequent check-in, he obtained a lot of treasures. And Yan Lao, who had previously arranged Song Wudao's mission, rarely came to this casting room. Basically, he stayed in his own casting room and didn't know what he was forging. On weekdays, Song Wudao's life is easy and comfortable. Pass, pass, pass. At a certain moment, Song Wudao, who was meditating in the casting room, suddenly opened his eyes and couldn't help looking to the west of the casting room. This is a cruel Taoist rhyme, it is ready to go, as if it can't wait to rush out of the ground. How is this going? Song Wudao couldn't help frowning, and for the first time felt this kind of Tao Yun that disgusted him so much. The caster room not far away seems to be something big. Click, click, bang, the world burst. Song Wudao was feeling, when a loud noise suddenly came, and the ground trembled slightly. Ha ha ha, I didn't expect it, I didn't expect it. I found a crack, ah ha 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 ha. Fortune is with me. On the Lianbing Mountain, the dark clouds are overwhelming, and the heaven and the earth can't see the five fingers. The spirit of evil spirits filled the room arbitrarily, and a casting room in the distance exploded and the earth and rocks flew randomly. A vast and broad figure stepped on the ground, with its head high above the sky, appearing in this world. Evil, invade my Tianhe sect, take your life. When the evil demon was born, a loud drink rang like thunder and spread to a radius of ten miles. On the mountain, a strong old man saw the evil demon making chaos, and went up to the sky, mixed with vitality and shot. He carried a silver knife on his shoulder, glaring at him, seeing the huge black shadow in the sky and killing it alone. Evil Demon Song Wudao was a little stunned when he heard Yan Lao shouting loudly. This world is demon prosperous, and there are many ghosts and monsters. It's just that what made him feel a little lost is that there will be demons in the Tianhe sect's super-grade sect territory. Too weak, Song Wudao felt this way the first time he saw it. In fact, Song Wudao felt that they were too weak, whether it was the Yan Lao who agitated his whole body, or the unknown demons with huge stature. Song Wudao even felt that he could squeeze them to death like an ant. Little monks, only the foundation-building cultivation base can dare to kill the deity, it's ridiculous. The black shadow in the sky rumbling. Die to me. After a grinning. In the sky, a huge bloody wave is rising against the sky, rolling like the sky. Bang. I saw the sound of thunder in the air. Yan Lao, who went like a thunderbolt, was shot flying in a flash. A bloody figure passed across the sky, staggeringly proving that there is an insurmountable gap between the strengths of the two. Old Yan, this tells me how to say you are good. Song Wudao couldn't help but complain. Song Wudao felt a little strange that Yan Lao was really so weak. According to the demons, Yan Lao is the realm of the foundation building. 
but my condensate has nine layers. Fortunately, old Yan is not dead. Song Wudao breathed a sigh of relief after investigating. After all, the old man Yan was very kind to him and took some care of him. It would be bad if he died. In the heavens and the earth, the evil demon exudes black killing intents, covering the entire mountainous boundary of the army. Under the black air that obscures the sky and the sun, even the vegetation is gradually withering and wilting, being robbed of vitality. When the demons came, they didn't even let go of the vegetation. Song Wudao stared at the front and headed west. His temperament suddenly changed, as the peerless divine armament showed a sharp edge, which was extremely dazzling. He wants to shoot. On the one hand, the people and demons in this world are not at odds with each other. On the other hand, his retreat in the casting room was very comfortable, and he felt a sense of tranquility in the years. He is also used to staying here quietly and cultivating, but he doesn't want to be ruined by someone. What? The evil demon shouted, and there was a kind of Taoist rhyme growing in the world. Is it a gold core powerhouse? What place is this? Bad. Before the evil demon's words were finished, the extremely sharp blade light flashed, illuminating the entire dim sky. The invincible evil demon just now was still intoxicated by the success of own. But he didn't want the sword light to sweep in the sky, everywhere in the sky, and in a daze, he saw the end of his beheaded beheaded. The shadow of death was overwhelming, making the demons terrified, wishing to leave here immediately. Only, the evil demon is compared to that overwhelming sword light. As the stone and the peak are competing for the hegemony, it is simply irresponsible. He wants to escape, but it is impossible to escape. When the silver glow fell, the tall figure in the sky and the earth disappeared instantly, as if erased, completely disappearing in this world. Unexpectedly weak. It turns out that my strength is stronger than I thought. Song Wudao was a little surprised when he suddenly appeared on the mountain of refining soldiers, and the demon with extremely arrogant posture was easily cut down by him. Seriously, he didn't use any strength at all. Why did the demon suddenly die? It is said that demons are powerful and evil, and he is too weak. Song Wudao pursed the corner of his mouth, shook his head in disgust, and walked in the direction of old Yan. As soon as he raised his foot, he stopped. Who's here? There was a strong and one weak aura in the distant sky. It seemed that someone in the Tianhe sect had discovered the evil demon just now, so he rushed over. Song Wudao immediately cancelled his plan to see Elder Yan, turned around, and walked along the way he came, as if nothing happened. The evil demon had been cut down by him, and someone came to finish it, so he just didn't have to worry about it. Master, what's the matter with the Dao Yan that just appeared near the Lianbing Mountain? Why is it suddenly gone again? Beside the clouds in the sky, a young girl with a charming figure appeared. There was a handful of icy blue flying sword at her feet, which flew her towards the mountain of refining soldiers. But her eyes were full of confusion, and she kept looking at the old man wearing azure Taoist robe and white beard and hair. The old man in Sing Yi stands by the void, surrounded by powerful Taoist rhyme. It's just that his expression is also a little puzzled at this time, he said with uncertainty, this is. Disciple, you go and invite sect leader. The old man looked towards the red sky covered with red clouds in the distance, and he became more and more puzzled. The breath of the evil demon was raging here just now. How come there is nothing left here in Lianbingshan in the blink of an eye? At any rate, he is also elder who is in charge of punishment by Tianhe sect. How could there be a perception error? It's just that, what happened just now? A group of figures rushed in quickly, standing high above the sky. Each of these figures wears gorgeous and exquisite Taoist gowns, overflowing with brilliance, and spreading extremely powerful Taoist rhymes. Sect leader, the evil spirit here is very exuberant, and we just found the nine nether cracks below. But no demons were seen in the cracks. Among the many figures, there is one who is surrounded by everyone. He has a clear appearance and is wearing a black Taoist robe. This person is the sect leader of the Tianhe sect. Seal this gap first. There was wisdom in his eyes, and after hearing Elder's report, he gave this order. After sect leader finished speaking, he looked around and probed again, his complexion couldn't help becoming heavy. It seems to be wondering where the evil demon has gone. How is Yan Hua? Sect leader asked Elder, the punishment that came first. The refining mountain is located in a remote location, 
and this time the evil spirit's rebellion only involves refining division Yan Hua. If Yan Hua can wake up, maybe part of the truth can be restored. He has no worries about his life. It's just that he was injured by the evil demon and hurt to the root. Moreover, his life is not much, I am afraid that it will take a long time to wake up. Penalty Elder shook his head, there was nothing he could do. After other people listened, their faces were very ugly. If outsiders know that the evil demon sneaked out of the Tianhe sect, sect's face is unnecessary. Master, at this time, the beautiful girl beside Penal Elder spoke, I can feel that there is a knife in this area. The girl's words fell like stones into the lake, causing ripples. Knife meaning, is that, someone shot. Everyone is a master, and they soon realized something. Here at Lianbing Mountain, there seems to be a senior's closed-door training place. If I remember correctly, the senior may have been closed-door training for 400 years. Could it be, that senior shot? An elder with a young and straight face, who looked very gentlemanly, patted his hands and suddenly remembered something. Chi Yan is right, my Tianhe sect has a long heritage, maybe there is a senior living in seclusion anywhere. Around Lianbing Mountain is the senior's seclusion. A demon in a mere sigh of relief, swaggering in front of that senior's door, must have been killed by that senior. An elder immediately affirmed and said confidently. After the two elders said, everyone showed a suddenly realized expression. Sect once had an expert who likes quietness the most to hide in the closed door training around Lianbing Mountain. This expert understands the sword all day, and is the most annoying talking to people and being disturbed by others. If an evil demon appears in this secluded place, the senior will behead the evil demon casually if he feels annoyed, and then leave without saying a word and restart closed door training, which is quite possible. Sect leader stood still in the void and pondered carefully. Suddenly he closed his eyes and emitted strong waves in the air, as if searching for something. The sword intent left in the void is indeed extremely powerful. The evil demon is dead. It's just that regardless of whether it's a senior's hand, we should be more vigilant if something like this happens. After sect leader finished speaking, all the elders looked serious, and they all agreed with sect leader's words. Moment. All that should have been said, everyone left here. Only a few responsible for the finishing touches and punishments, Elder did not leave. Disciple, come here first. Apprentice, you have reached the realm on the ninth floor of Transcendence. It just happened today. There is a chance for you in this mountain of soldiers. Penalty Elder saw the disciples want to leave directly, and said directly to her. Opportunity, the beautiful girl named Kaishuan was stunned and looked very confused. She didn't know why the master called her to stop. No one has ever asked about refining Soldier Mountain, except for those who come to get weapons, very few people will come here. What's the chance here? The girl is not irritable, and honestly waits for the master's answer. Penalty Elder chuckled, and looked at the refining hill below. Shuaner, this mountain for refining soldiers comes from my ancestor of the Tianhe sect Zhanzong. The oldest casting room is more than 7,000 years old. For more than 7,000 years, Countless masters have tried out here, leaving behind countless traces of aura and rhyme. Kai Zan, your super body, is naturally good at comprehending the rhyme of Taoism, for you who will immediately enter the liquid state. It's definitely beneficial to have more experience here. Hearing the explanation from the master, the girl suddenly enlightened. In fact, it was the first time she came here, but she felt that this place was very familiar, so it was. Thank you for your guidance, the girl said respectfully. Penalty Elder nodded in satisfaction, and in a flash, it turned into a gust of wind and disappeared. After Elder left, Kaishuan also landed on Refining Hill with expectant eyes. The master is right, there are really a lot of Taoist rhymes here. If you come back a few more times, it might be of great benefit. The girl moved with her heart, and gradually felt. Silently, the girl walked into a hot casting room. Um, who? As soon as she entered the casting room, the girl's eyes condensed, and she looked at the casting room in surprise. There were people in it. In front of her, was a very clean, ordinary-faced teenager. At this time, the young man was using his somewhat slender arms to carry the heavy profound iron ore with great effort. It's weird, the eyes of the young man were always firmly closed during this process, as if there was no need for light. Ah, this is, a debilitated person. Ji Yu Kaishuan's expression condensed, 
and she immediately saw that the young man in front of her was a natural handicapped person who was born with an eye disease. With a flash of inspiration, the girl thought of something. She seems to have indeed heard others say that there is a natural disabled person who has died of both parents and has no talent. Some accidents, it turns out that this young man actually stayed here. It's a bit bleak. Ji Yu Kaishuan looked at the young man in front of him holding a piece of ore and moving slowly, suddenly pitying. The girl comes from an excellent background and knows a lot of things that other people don't know. Naturally disabled people are obviously different from other disabled people. This is a kind of disease, a kind of punishment, a kind of punishment from heaven, and no one can cure it in rumors. Think about it carefully, this kind of punishment for following people for a lifetime is really terrible. If this is herself, she can't imagine. The girl looked at the boy's eyes again, unconsciously softer. Puff, the black mysterious iron ore was finally thrown into the hot golden red water. What will the girl do? The voice of the teenager in the quiet caster room sounded. This boy is Song Wudao. When someone walks into the casting room, how can he not find out who has been able to cultivate? But this is normal. Just now the demons made such a big movement in refining Soldier Mountain, how could no one come to investigate? That's why he moved his hand and pretended to be an ordinary person. It's just that he still wondered that others won't stay for too long, but he didn't expect this person to stand in the casting room without saying a word and stop. He had to interrupt. What? The girl was shocked, and she always thought that she hadn't been discovered. She was suddenly ashamed. It was too rude to look at the other person like this for a long time, even though the other person couldn't see what he was doing. Ji Yu Kaishuan immediately replied, Ah, I just walk around, didn't delay your work, right? No, Song Wudao heard a soft voice, and he shook his head helplessly. The girl's answer was obviously flustered. Song Wudao had dispelled his suspicion, the girl could not be the strong one sent by sect to investigate. Hello, my name is Ji Yu Kaishuan, what is your name? Seeing Song Wudao answer her own question, Ji Yu Kaishuan felt relieved and continued to observe him, a rare natural disabled person. It was a bit rude to just observe directly, so she gave out her own name, so as not to bore the other party. Song Wudao, is there anything else? Song Wudao spoke bluntly, and under Ji Yu Kaishuan's attention, he threw a heavy oar into the golden red hot pool water. Um, do you use me to help? Need not. Well, what are you doing now? Quenching the oar. Then what do you want to do to refine the oar? Do not know. Ah, that's it. Then you must be very hard, right? Generally. Perhaps he felt that Song Wudao's situation was too bleak. Ji Yu Kaishuan was very enthusiastic, and accompanied Song Wudao to nag for a long time, asking this and that. The only difference from Ji Yu Kaishuan was that Song Wudao seldom spoke, and seemed a little silent. Regarding this, Ji Yu Kaishuan didn't mind at all, she thought it was normal. It's just that Ji Yu Kaishuan couldn't always accompany him. She also understood that it was time for the conversation to end. Seeing Song Wudao showing some boredom, she quickly ended the conversation and walked out of the casting room. After Ji Yu Kaishuan left, Song Wudao finally felt calmed down. With a wave of his hand, the densely packed ore rose into the air, and was thrown into the hot golden red molten slurry in a flash. As the Taoist rhyme between heaven and earth, it's a bit troublesome not to see it, but it's not bad. He thought silently. When Ji Yu Kaishuan just chatted with him, she explained her reason for coming here. The rhyme left by these masters who have tried their troops, although there are many, it is indeed worthy of attention. Probably because of his eyes, he did not notice the rhyme attached to the objects between heaven and earth. After Ji Yu Kaishuan said this, Song Wudao remembered it. The casting room, after seeing Ji Yu Kaishuan staying for a while, she left. Song Wudao was attentively attentive, touching it carefully, and slowly sensing the mountain, stone, grass, and wood in this place. Sure enough, under his nine-layer realm, he realized with his heart and gained a lot of gains. Six years later, the sudden emergence of Juyu Crack in Lianbing Mountain has long been repaired and sealed by Tianhe sect. The disturbance brought by the evil spirits has turned into dust under the time of the study, and will never be seen again. In the past six years, Ji Yu Kaishuan has been in and out of Lianbing Mountain frequently, so she has gradually become acquainted with Song Wudao. Song Wudao became more and more familiar with Lianbing Mountain. 
only in very rare cases, Yan Lao, as a military refiner, would come to interfere with Song Wudao's life. During the six years of Song Wudao's life, he had a very peaceful and comfortable life. One morning, the morning sun shone into the mountains. Finally foundation building, Song Wudao, who was meditating, suddenly relaxed his body, his movements were very casual, but his temperament became more and more illusory, immortal and proud. It seems that an essential change has taken place. Speaking of it, originally he could reach the foundation building faster, but he worked slowly and carefully. In the six years, he signed in Lianbingshan for an unknown number of times and got countless opportunities, finally. The foundation of the avenue made with these treasures is truly extraordinary. After the foundation was built, Song Wudao rarely smiled. Song Wudao, come. Suddenly, Song Wudao heard the sound transmission from Yan Lao to him. Song Wudao paused. It was the first time he called Song Wudao in the past seven years since Yan Lao returned. Song Wudao didn't neglect, but with doubts, he went to the residence where Yan Lao lived all year round in the Lianbing Mountain. As soon as he entered Yan Lao's room, Song Wudao's footsteps stopped again. He could feel that Yan Lao's breath of life was very weak, like a candle that was about to burn out, only the last time was left. Old Yan, are you going to die? Song Wudao guessed right, Yan Lao is indeed at the end of his life. In fact, after a few years, he will always have some contact with Yan Lao, so he clearly feels that Yan Lao's body is getting weaker and weaker. He knew that this was the root cause of the disease when Yan Lao blocked the evil spirits and was severely injured. It's just that Yan's injury has already reached this point. Song Wu Dao. Old Yan heard the footsteps at the door, so he said. Immediately his thoughts diverged, and his injuries made it difficult to concentrate. Think about it, it has been many years since Song Wu Dao came here, and he has grown from a boy to a young man. Over the years, because of his injuries, he didn't spend most of the time on Song Wu Dao. But with the remaining contact, he could still feel Song Wu Dao's steady and introverted character, as well as his persistence in cultivation. Even though his talent was poor, Song Wu Dao still insisted on practicing. It's just, it's still the low level realm of Kaiyuan third stage. Old Yan sighed in his heart. He has never been glorious in his military mountain line, but now. Ah, Lao Yan, you, Song Wu Dao said when he came to Yan Lao. I'm dying, Old Yan said directly unspeakably lonely in his tone. A sense of grief arose in Song Wu's Dao heart. People are not grass and trees, who can be ruthless, and Yan Lao is a rare and familiar person in this huge Tianhe sect. He opened his mouth and wanted to say some comforting words, but Yan Lao waved his hand, everyone has his own fate, so don't say much. Sit down, old Yan pointed to the side, his eyes gradually showing memories. I think I have passed on for thousands of years, but it has finally fallen into decline. The previous disaster made me the only one who was struggling to support the refining mountain, and even the inheritance was lost. Having said this, old Yan sighed, his eyes fell on Song Wu Dao. Now even I have to go. After I leave, you have to continue the inheritance of refining mountain. This is our Taiwei casting technique in refining mountain. The cultivation technique is divided into three stages and nine ranks. This casting technique belongs to the third stage. The ninth rank of the second realm is a rare high rank cultivation technique. I was afraid that you didn't understand, I taught you with my own hands, but I didn't think that my injury was so serious, I was afraid that I would have no chance. As he said, Old Yan took the slightly yellowed book from the side. Lao Yan, Song Wu Dao looked at Yan Lao's increasingly declining face, but he didn't say anything in the end. He didn't expect that before the other party died, he would actually entrust the inheritance to himself. On the face of it, he was not only a very low realm, but also a blind little cultivator. I am afraid that in this Tianhe sect, just looking for a disciple will not be worse than him. Don't think too much, Yan Lao said, if there is no one in the refining mountain now, I would not choose you. Although you are not endowed, you have been here for a few years. The foundation of the association will be. This will facilitate the inheritance of Lianbingshan's lineage. Okay, take the inheritance and go to Insight. The text in the book is specially made. Even if you can't see it, you can read it with a little effort. I have also commented on the difficulties in the book. That's all I can help you, go. 
Old Yan didn't want people to see his embarrassed appearance and told him to leave. Song Wudao was quiet, and then said, Thank you Yan Lao, then I will leave. Song Wudao got up, when Yan Lao's voice came again, explaining some trivial matters. After I die, remember to bury me. After refining Soldier Mountain, it will be maintained by you. It may be a little bit difficult, but sect will be paid out every month. Old Yan seemed to be very unwilling to give up on Lianbing Mountain, who had been worrying about him all his life. Song Wudao had to stop temporarily as he talked more and more. The caster room on the west side was exhausted once. You must remember to maintain it on time. These things are in the book I gave you. The casting room in the south has a lot of mineral deposits. After you learn how to forge soldiers, remember to go there to find materials. There are a lot of materials. East, Song Wudao listened patiently and wrote down these things one by one. While speaking, Yan Old seemed to think of something. Oh, people are getting old, and their memory is so bad. He frowned and looked at Xi'an Song Wudao, his face serious. Finally, I will tell you something very important at first sight. You have to listen carefully, it's your life. Song Wu's curiosity arose in Dao's heart, and Yan Lao's voice came. Remember, although you are taking care of the refining mountain now, you must never enter the forbidden area behind the refining mountain. In that forbidden area, if there is no cultivation base, there will only be dead words to enter. Your cultivation base Kaiyuan third stage, your talent is extremely poor, and it will be impossible for you to have anything to do with it in your life. So don't break in without permission, you will lose your life for nothing. Song Wudao nodded. His strength was hidden by himself. Old Yan mistakenly thought that own realm was Kaiyuan third stage, so he solemnly told him. In fact, he is no longer what he used to be, and his situational talent is far more than before. Suddenly a certain segment flashed through his mind. Song Wudao, who had been in Lianbing Mountain for several years, had already tried every place where he could sign, except for one place. It seems that as old Yan said, there is indeed the back mountain of refining Soldier Mountain. Every time Song Wudao approaches, he will feel like a glow on his back, stinging his skin. From the Dao Yun shrouded there, he could feel a kind of extreme sharpness, subtle and mysterious, which made him afraid to approach. Where is the forbidden land that Yan Lao said? It should be, if it is not there, there is no other place to match it. Buried the secret of Lianbing Mountain. Or what? After seeing the forbidden land, he gave birth to curious Song Wudao, once again attracted by the forbidden land. There must be something important in such a mysterious place, I don't know what I can get by signing in in the forbidden area. Song Wudao thought, he naturally didn't ask these words in front of Old Yan. He knew that even if he asked, Old Yan couldn't tell him anything. What's more, Yan Lao may not know the specific situation. All right, as people grow old, they talk a lot. You can go now. Old Yan seemed a little lonely. When the voice came, Song Wudao understood that his own matter was over. Yan Lao asked him to come here, just to tell him about the inheritance and refining mountain. It is useless for him to stay here, and Yan Lao also told him to leave. So Song Wudao bowed his cupped hands and turned away again. In an instant, three days later, Yan Lao died at home. But because Yan Lao was lonely and there was no one beside him except Song Wudao, Song Wudao did his best to organize a funeral for Yan Lao hastily. In the Tianhe sect, people are still very busy. It seems that because of the complete decline of the refining mountain line, no one has said anything about the fall of the last refining division, sect. The mountain of refining soldiers also seems to be forgotten by people. Song Wudao didn't care, he was so happy that no one interrupted him. So that's it, time has come five years later. In the past five years, Song Wudao has been practicing almost all the time. In addition to signing into practice, he also understood it the first day he got the Taiwei weapon casting technique, so he sometimes tried to forge weapons. After these attempts, he gradually discovered that building weapons is also an interesting thing, so casting has gradually become a small hobby for him. During the five years, Ji Yu Kaishuan would come occasionally, so Song Wudao spent most of the time enjoying the peace and fun of cultivation alone, which made him very satisfied. Over the years, his cultivation base has also unknowingly reached the foundation building ninth stage. 
With his sign-in, the quality of the resources provided by Lianbingxian has become not very good for him now. Therefore, he should also try to find some new check-in locations. Forbidden area in the back mountain. Song Wudao recalled what Yan Lao said to himself before his death. There must be something good there. But, before Yan dying, he instructed Song Wudao not to enter, otherwise he would die. But he also said that if you want to go in, you need at least a spectacular cultivation base. Shanbao is the next realm of the foundation building. Now Song Wudao has the foundation building ninth stage, not far from Shanbao. Moreover, he has seen the scene of Yan Lao blocking demons and knows that the strength of own cultivation base far exceeds that of people in the same state. Although the specific reason, he didn't know. It may be because the cultivation technique he practiced is from the galaxy cluster sword skill of the heaven. However, his current strength must have reached this standard. It's not a bad idea to go and give it a try. After making up his mind, Song Wudao walked to the back mountain of the Lianbing Mountain, and soon he came to the back mountain forbidden area. Around the forbidden area, a bleak portal stands tall, looking inconspicuous, but the rhyme of Taoism revealed in it is hard to underestimate. It is full of sharp, subtle and ethereal feeling, as if it contains infinite possibilities. Song Wudao perceives that the murderous intent is fatal in the unwavering Dao Yun. In the past five years, Song Wudao wanted to enter it several times, but he retreated because of his scruples about the rhyme of Taoism. But now I came here again. Five years ago, the Dao Yun, which had let him be like a man's back, was shining at any time, and it was much better, but it made him feel cold. Obviously able to adapt, without threats, he walked forward. As Song Wudao approached this Taoist rhyme, he suddenly felt a familiar feeling. This is, two-way forging warcraft, like, very much like. Could it be that this is related to Taiwei's forging warcraft? Yes, this is the boundary of refining soldier mountain after all. Song Wudao wondered to himself, then walked through the door and stepped into it. After entering, the rhyme of Dao became stronger, wrapping him like deep sea water. Song Wu's Dao heart sank. With his perception, the time and space here seemed to have changed, and he entered an unpredictable place. At this time, the strong rhyme of Dao here seemed to sense him as an intruder, and they gathered around him together, making Song Wu Dao's shoulders heavier and heavier. In his body, Tai Wei's art of forging soldiers was guided by the rich Taoist rhyme of this heaven and earth, and it turned on its own. The Dao Yun here is actually used for protection and identification. Song Wu Dao felt magical. If it hadn't been the spontaneous action of Tai Wei weapon cultivation that he cultivated in his body, I am afraid that the first thing he would face is all the attacks of Dao Yun here, even if he is not afraid of himself, it would be quite troublesome. Song Wu Dao walked forward, probably because this authentic charm is pervasive and contains a sense of sharpness. It is very desolate and there is no grass. And the farther he went, the more vitality of the world in front of him became stronger, which made him even more surprised. With his keen perception and familiarity with treasures, Song Wu Dao can feel that there are actually many items that are precious to ordinary foundation building cultivators. However, Song Wu Dao was a bit dismissive. Without him, the treasures he got after signing in had already changed his taste. These things that are almost useless to him now appear in front of him, but it will only make him feel that it is troublesome to reach out to pick them up. Suddenly Song Wu Dao's body stagnated, as if he felt something. He stretched out one hand and touched it forward, keeping the other hand on alert. The touch was a cold and hard dent. Following the dent, Song Wu Dao gradually understood that this was a stone monument. Burial Knife Pit Song Wu Dao read, This is the inscription on the steel. The burial pit, it is a bit expectant, and I don't know what the chance is. He said to himself, System, sign in. Song Wu Dao quickly issued an order to the system, and the system's voice came quickly as well. Ding, congratulations to the host, you have successfully signed into the burial pit and won the demon slashing technique. Nodded, Song Wu Dao immediately checked the check in income. In my mind, a book with a yellow and white cover and sharp gestures appeared. As Song Wu Dao's thoughts changed, the book went without wind. He quickly understood the essence of the book. It was actually the saber technique. Since acquiring the system, he always got medicine pill, yuan shi and the like every time he checked in, and saber technique was extremely rare, so his attack methods were a bit poor compared to his cultivation base. 
The demon slashing technique in front of him can be used as one of his attack methods to better display his strength. Yes, it can work well with galaxy cluster knife skills. Song Wudao said happily, and according to the classification of the ninth rank of the three realms, the quality of the monster slashing technique was even higher than that of the ninth rank of the third realm, and it was a rare treasure. How could he not be happy to get such a treasure? As a person who has been accustomed to cultivating alone all the year round, Song Wudao is more able to experience the happiness that he did not have before through cultivation. Think about it, before, as a blind man with low talent and natural disability, he had a very hard life. Finally, cultivation rescued him from the abyss, and because of this, he gradually fell in love with cultivation. This demon slashing tactic, for a person who loves cultivation, is simply a joy from heaven. This trip didn't come in vain. He was extremely satisfied with this sword art. When Song Wudao was smiling, suddenly the world trembled inexplicably, as if something major event was about to happen, full of wind and rain. Dark clouds gathered in the sky, and it was as black as ink, covering the sky, leaving the sky and the earth without light. The invisible front of Song Wudao was a deep pit filled with various broken knives. Although these knives had been broken, there was still a shimmering spirit flowing in his body. The sky is intertwined with thunder and wind, and suddenly, boom, a hideous and silent behemoth condensed from the bottom of the pit. This is a giant snake made of white bones. It straightened its body slightly, and the snake's body passed through the clouds. Above the clouds, two dark and hollow eyes looked down at Song Wudao, the only living thing around. After staring for a while, its body sank suddenly, like a huge mountain falling into the deep sea, and the clouds stirred up huge waves. Under the clouds, the snake had attacked Song Wudao who seemed unaware of it. The sky and the earth were pitch black, the dense clouds of thunder and lightning kept flickering, and occasionally a thunder blasted, and the bright light emitted instantly illuminated this oppressive world. A palpitating sight appeared for an instant, and then quickly plunged into darkness. In the short moment of being illuminated, the body of the bone snake is as impressive as the Optimus Prime. Its body went straight into the sea of clouds and was hidden by the clouds, so it was impossible to see its head. Boom, the sea of clouds was suddenly forced to separate, and two huge waves of clouds lined up around, like two majestic high walls that suddenly appeared. The sky poured down like a waterfall, illuminating all the scenery in this world, but under this sky, there was a terrifying shadow like a demon god, the skull of a bone snake. The air was compressed, making a heavy sound, and the terrifying shadow struck Song Wudao. Interesting. A chuckle sounded in the open space. As if responding to this voice, a dazzling river of silver blades rose from the ground and swept up like a snow-white waterfall flowing backwards from the earth to the sky. The vast and sharp rhyme of Taoism arbitrarily diffuses and spreads in the world. Roar. Suddenly the giant snake let out a earth-shaking roar. It instinctively felt the deadly murderous intent, which made it deeply fear from the heart. In the dark and dark eyes, inexplicable fear flashed unexpectedly. Who is this person? The blade light he cleaved was too terrifying, and the blade power was like an immortal. Even with such a long distance now, he could still clearly feel the death threat brought by it. Terrible, too terrible, I can't even manage to escape. But in its eyes, it was clear that the light of the sword was just the sight of the young man waving the long sword in his hand at will. The giant snake couldn't help but feel powerless and desperate. Today it has to meet the gods. Roar, the giant snake was deeply unwilling to accept this fate of tragic death. It moved a huge body, showing a terrible power that was enough to make people shocked or fearful, and the body crashed down. The roar resembling a masterpiece resounded all over the world, but there was no way to conceal the fear in it. Clang, the light of the knife collided with the body of the huge bone snake, slashing on its bones as hard as gold and iron, making a loud noise. The world was stagnant for this impact, and there was silence around the world. It took a while before there was a sound. It was the sound of rock-like bones falling from the sky to the ground after the bone snake was chopped into pieces. It's a crackling sound like fireworks. After the fireworks, the huge and terrifying giant snake just left behind a pile of stones, gathered together. It seems that everything before is a false phantom. After the forbidden area of the mountain behind the Lianbing Mountain, the giant snake fell. At the same time, in the sect Great Hall of the Tianhe sect, here is magnificent and magnificent, filled with fairy mist, and the fragrance of calming and concentrating is permeated. 
The Tianhe sect sect leader, who was originally sitting on the luxurious futon, closed his eyes and quietly cultivated, suddenly his eyelids trembled, and quickly opened his eyes, looking towards Lianbing Mountain with full solemnity. What? He said. The horror of this movement can be seen so that he, who has already possessed the seventh stage cultivation base of Dongxuan, is so gaff. What a powerful Daoyun breath. This kind of Taoist rhyme, at least is the top of the cave profound realm. Sect leader sensed it with all his strength. Although this Dao Yun breath was very weak and the distance was very far away, it was still caught by sect leader. Within the Tianhe sect, such an unidentified and powerful breath appeared. His eyes were gloomy, and he couldn't help but worry. What happened in the clan? Suddenly there was a word in his mouth, and then he whispered. Go. He shot out trails of misty white fairy lights, disappeared in the blink of an eye, and quickly returned to him, but they seemed to have caught something. Um, the scene is shrouded in darkness, and nothing can be seen. Suddenly, sect leader showed a look of surprise, he sensed. What? This rhyme turned out to be two. Moreover, one of them was suddenly defeated. Who is making the shot? Sect leader looked at Lianbingshan's face getting heavier and heavier. This matter was not trivial, and he had to think carefully. A flash of lightning flashed across his mind, and he suddenly realized. Such a strong, too weak casting of the rhyme of military art, so to speak. Who is it? Sect leader breathed a sigh of relief, yes, that's it. Now that the younger disciples of Lianbing Mountain are declining, no one in the door can practice Taiwei casting art to this point. It's just that the person who has appeared more than once in recent years, what does this mean? Then he suddenly realized and said with joy, which one finally broke the bottleneck and entered the unpredictable realm. Ha ha, sect leader smiled affirmatively. It just happens that the world is not peaceful recently, and there is a taste of wind and rain, and all kinds of demon ghosts seem to be unable to hold back. And now, the ancestors are finally making progress, and going further, this is an extremely important guarantee for the tranquility of the Tianhe sect and the surrounding area. In the Tianhe sect, many masters have noticed this since the aura of the Taoist rhyme was revealed. But after feeling the rich Taoist rhyme of Taiwei forging Warcraft, the perception has receded. The face was cold and joyful. Since the other party didn't tell them about the exit, it's better not to disturb so as not to be disgusted by the ancestor, and suffered in vain. Refining Soldier Mountain Song Wudao is still remembering what happened just now. So weak, I died without knowing it. The pomp is not small, but it's just a little demon. Song Wudao said that a sense of threat had suddenly emerged before, and he immediately used the demon cutting technique he had learned to cut it out as a test. But he didn't want the source of this threat to be directly killed by him. He couldn't even explore it. Song Wudao, who rarely goes out, still wants to meet a considerable opponent so as to measure his own strength. It was just a little demon who hit the door, which made him look forward to it in vain. Never mind, that's not bad, it saves a lot of fighting. But, the demon slashing art really deserves the name of slashing the demon, killing monsters is really easy, and it can even restrain them. And this is not its ultimate power, there are many things to dig deeper. Song Wudao felt that being able to harvest this sword art this time was already a great harvest. At this time, a cold and proud voice suddenly sounded in the open surroundings, and people felt a sharp voice. Junior, although this sound was not loud, it made Song Wudao feel a deep sense of crisis. Song Wudao responded quickly and vigilantly. Who is senior? Why not show up? This voice continued to speak, as if Song Wudao could not be heard. Since you have passed the bone snake level, it means you have finished my test of you. Second generation, don't worry, if this message is not cleared, it proves that I have truly fallen. Concentrate and accept this knowledge. Remember, to those who pass on to you is for. Sword saint, knife saint, never heard of it. However, the inexplicable voice around didn't explain anything, it seemed that it just made people remember his name. It seems to be very satisfied with this name, even death has to mention it. But inheritance, how did you get the inheritance? Song Wudao recalled what the man who claimed to be the saint of swords said just now, it seemed that it was because he killed a monster named Bone Snake. It turned out that the monster he killed was a bone snake. But it was too weak, the monster that was so weak that it was not worth mentioning was still a level. Is it because this heritage is not strong enough? 
Just as Song Wudao thought to himself, a very mysterious feeling came to his mind. The silver light on his body was shining, and an unusually comfortable warmth flowed through his body. At the same time, a hazy figure with his back facing him appeared in his mind, and a thin layer of white light flowed on this figure. Song Wudao took a closer look and found that these shreds of light turned out to be shocking blades of light. Just a single shot made Song Wudao feel more pressured, and these thousands of them, I'm afraid he will be wiped out as soon as he touches them. Song Wudao secretly rejoiced, luckily it was just a projected phantom, not a real person, otherwise he could not bear it. At the same time, he also put away the slight contempt that he had just raised, and got serious. At this moment, the figure in front of him began to say. I am the saint of swordsmen. Knife saint, the meaning of the saint hand in the knife. I love knives most in this life, and the second zijing. In his lifetime, he was the supreme supreme elder of the Tianhe sect, and also the seventh mountain lord of Lianbing Mountain. A little false name, it is not worth mentioning. I love knives, since I have held them in my life, the knives have never been far away from me. Even if I encounter a strong player, I'm just overwhelmed by obstacles, pushing it all the way, and I can't let me throw away the knife. The way to practice the sword, one after another into the cave profound, to the heaven, you can't lose it. The opponents of my life are all under my sword and bow their heads. The people of the world, in the end, there is no enemy of me. I sit quietly so as not to be disturbed. I have taken the heads of several sect leaders in the world. The world is silent for a while, no one dares to bother. However, in the end, I couldn't walk into the avenue and look straight at the top of the sword road. Having said that, the figure in front of Song Wudao seemed to sigh slightly. It's a pity, it's a pity. Younger generation, this is the regret of my life. In my life, I was born only on the Dao Dao, but I have not reached the top of the Dao Dao. Today I will give you my understanding of knives and the knife that I love in my life. I hope you can walk through the road and watch the peak of the sword road for me. The voice gradually disappeared, and then the figure shattered and turned into a flood of information into Song Wudao's mind. And in this information, not only the knife saint senior's understanding of the knife, but also other miscellaneous explanations. It turned out to be like this. Song Wudao said to himself after reading it roughly. This is the Supreme Elder from Refining Soldier Mountain, and then I don't know when this Supreme Elder began to retreat. Later, this majestic elder had a premonition that he had no hope of entering the next realm, so he left this opportunity for his descendants to pass on. And Song Wudao is his junior. Song Wudao carefully checked the part about how to get the chance, only to look at his expression but began to feel embarrassed. If you want to get the inheritance, you have to face the level set by the Sword Saint Senior. First of all, it is required that the passer through must be from the Tianhe sect. And next, it is best to be a person from Refining Mountain, if you are not a person from Refining Mountain, and have not cultivated the inheritance of Refining Army Mountain, you will be troubled by the saintly Taoist rhyme that can be seen everywhere when you first enter the Forbidden Area. And as long as the people of Lianbing Mountain have cultivated the inheritance of Lianbing Mountain, they will not encounter this trouble. Song Wudao just met this condition, so he went all the way and walked very smoothly. However, these are not the reasons for his embarrassment. It's the next thing, the content of this level. This content is naturally the skull snake, but this too high elder didn't mean to behead it. As long as the incoming person can escape the blow of the skull snake, the bone snake will disperse, and the incoming person will pass automatically and gain inheritance. However, he directly killed the skull snake. They passed it on to him, but he killed their pets, which was a bit embarrassing. Knife Saint Mogwa, anyway, we are all a family, I will accept your inheritance, and I will accept your pet as well. Don't be angry, anyway, if you know the ground, you can't find it. If you are angry, you can easily get angry, isn't it? Song Wudao talked to himself with some guilty conscience. Oh, he said suddenly, it turns out that the bone snake is not a living thing, it's just something out of the senior good fortune. Senior, you said in advance in the record, it made me feel guilty. Unconsciously, Song Wudao's face seemed to thicken a little. This is probably because he is good at persistence. In fact, the life of hardship over the past ten years has brought him a lot of things. Tisk. Song Wudao sighed, this senior, 
who is called the saint of swordsmen, is really an immortal means, and he can use his vitality to imitate living things. The road of monasticism is currently known. There are eight realms, Kaiyuan, Shuanfen, Condensate, Foundation Building, Shanpu, Gold Core, Dongxuan, and Tianguan. According to the records in the inheritance, the Sword Saint Senior has been the first person among his peers to break through since his cultivation. The peers are invincible, even chasing the previous generation, and then surpassing the previous generation one by one, into the invincible. The realm, it can be said to be a peerless genius who can only meet one in a few eras. It's just that such a peerless Tianzhao, in the end, he only reached the peak of Tianguan, and failed to get a higher view of realm. In the end, I sat down here. Senior's life, it's really a pity. The talent is so high, but it finally fell on the road to the road. After reading the record of the life of Dao Sheng Senior, Song Wu Dao was inexplicably sad. Senior don't worry, I will go to the top of the sword for you to see the scenery there. After all, I also have a good relationship with Dao Dao. Since the rapid progress of cultivation, most of the important things I have obtained are related to knives. And after all these years, I also love knives very much. I will help you achieve all the seniors will. After reading these mixed information, Song Wu Dao finally turned to the main part of the Sword Saint inheritance. After just watching it for a while, Song Wu Dao was shocked and his expression became more focused. Senior deserves to be known as the Saint of Swordsmen. This understanding of Dao Dao can at least save me more than 10 years of hard work, and it will even play a great role in the future. After Song Wu Dao saw what was left by Saint Sword, he said. Such an insight into the avenue, as explained by the annotations, can enable Song Wu Dao to walk the road from the ninth floor of the foundation building to the Tianguan faster, which is a shortcut to a higher realm. Next, it's time to see the knives left by Senior. Song Wu Dao performed a kind of induction technique in accordance with the operation method left by the Sword Saint. Following the exercise of Song Wu Dao's technique, in the huge deep hole with the broken knife in front of him, the 10,000 knives trembled and screamed, and a knife that exuded the mysterious Taoist rhyme flew from the bottom. Boom, Song Wu Dao flicked the blade of the blade, and a clear, solid vibrato sounded. In a short time, the sound of a knife overwhelmed the sound of 10,000 knives. Good knife. The moment the knife started, he knew that this was the only treasure he had seen in his life, and he couldn't praise it too much. After a long time of taste, Song Wu Dao heart left with satisfaction and returned to the mountain of refining soldiers. In the past ten days in a row, Tianhe sect still remained silent. As if he hadn't noticed the momentum that Song Wu Dao caused in the Forbidden Land that day, Lian Bingxin continued to be ignored by sect, as if abandoned by others. As time passed by day by day, Song Wu Dao was not in a hurry to cultivate. For cultivators with lifespans of hundreds or thousands, time is often their richest thing, so unless they reach the end of their life, time is also the most easily overlooked thing for them. In a flash, it was twenty years later. For twenty years, Lian Bingxin has been in peace for a long time. Except for Ji Yu Kaishuan who occasionally came here to observe Taoist rhyme, no one else would come. It's just that in recent years, Ji Yu Kaishuan's Daoyun has been repeatedly watched by Ji Yu Kaishuan too many times, and the effect it can bring to her for the time being is getting less and less, so Ji Yu Kaishuan rarely comes. On this day, the sun was shining brightly, the sky was cloudless, and a beautiful figure passed across the blue sky, leaving an elegant curve. A certain casting room in Lianbingshan was filled with red light, covering the entire stone room, and the continuous sound of iron striking came from the cave entrance. Clang, clang, Ji Yu Kaishuan jumped off the flying sword and came to this casting room. Over time, Song Wu Dao's body looked stronger, and the muscles that swelled up when he hit the iron were also very beautiful, but at first glance, he was still a little thin. Stepping into the stone room, Ji Yu Kaishuan did not disturb Song Wu Dao aloud, but first found a place to stay and waited beside her. She is light and light, like a spring flower in full bloom, and because of her appearance, this hot cave seems to be a lot cooler. After Ji Yu Kaishuan's beautiful eyes stared at Song Wu Dao, she had long changed her impression of Song Wu Dao through contact with Song Wu Dao over the years. At the beginning, she felt compassion for Song Wu Dao because of his blindness, low talent, and extremely poor situation. But later, she discovered that Song Wu Dao didn't need his own mercy. Even in such a difficult situation, 
Song Wu Dao could still maintain a steady heart toward Dao. This state of mind makes Ji Yu Kaishuan especially admired, so whenever Ji Yu Kaishuan is confused on cultivation, she will come here. Not necessarily chatting with Song Wu Dao, just staying here, seeing Song Wu Dao, has already made her confused heart feel peaceful and filled with forward power again. On the side, Song Wu Dao still swayed the hammer vigorously, hitting a rough knife blade on the workbench. Suddenly, sparks shot up in the air with sonorous sounds. Clang, clang. Under the gouge of Song Wu Dao's hammer, the long knife embryo gradually took shape, and a faint layer of magic flowed, making the embryo look extraordinary. Time passed, it seemed that a long time had passed, and it didn't seem to be. After the last violent percussion, Song Wu Dao stopped waving his arms. Call. He took a breath, his chest was violently ups and downs, and his whole body was sweaty. Ji Yu Kaishuan, as if confirming, he said to one side. It's me. Ji Yu Kaishuan responded, How are you? I'm preparing for the foundation building these days, so I didn't come here much. But fortunately, after so much hard work, I can finally start foundation building. Song Wu Dao smiled a little after hearing this, as if he was happy for Ji Yu Kaishuan. Then congratulations, judging from the common sense left by the Knife Saint Senior, in the world of cultivation, one who can be promoted to condensate realm before the age of 80 can be called a genius. And Ji Yu Kaishuan can reach the foundation building realm at such a young age, and she is also a different kind of genius. As for himself, he has a system and is not comparable at all. For 20 years, he has been irrigated with a lot of opportunities every day, which makes him enter the realm of illusion from the foundation building ninth stage. To be precise, a master of less than 50 such as him, in the cultivation world, is no longer shocking, but shocking. If the general cultivator outside gets this news and confirms that it is true, then they will be scared to death if they make trouble, and they will call it haunted. But the most jealous thing is more than that. Over the years, Song Wu Dao has understood and understood most of the Knife Saint Senior's understanding and understanding of the knife. Now in the world, his mastery of the knife and the way, I am afraid that few people can match it. And through constant cultivation insight, he has slowly seen the road ahead, knowing where to go. This kind of performance is terrifying. Ha ha, it's okay. Ji Yu Kaishuan smiled softly, her voice pleasant. By the way, did you give you Guiyuan pill last time? Ji Yu Kaishuan said suddenly. Did it, what's the matter? Song Wu Dao asked. Ji Yu Kaishuan seemed to scratch her head, and said in confusion, it shouldn't be, it should be a breakthrough. Song Wu Dao was taken aback for a moment, and then he remembered that his disguised realm was Kaiyuan ninth stage, so he pretended to be innocent. But my aptitude is too bad, and the effect of the medicine is less absorbed, right? Ji Yu Kaishuan nodded, accepted his explanation, and then she said. Then I'll give you another one, and strive to break through to realm as soon as possible. If you are such a determined seeker, it would be a shame to die early because of insufficient lifespan. Don't shirk like you did last time. Anyway, you accepted it once, and it's not bad this time. Ji Yu Kaishuan said rushingly, for fear that Song Wu Dao would not accept it. That's good. Song Wu Dao took medicine pill with a wry smile. This, he didn't need it, but he couldn't refute Ji Yu Kaishuan's kindness, so he had to take it. After that, Ji Yu Kaishuan continued to chat with Song Wu Dao until the sun was westward, she got up and left. At this time, a hundred miles away from Tianhe sect's Lianbing Mountain, two hidden figures were sneaky. The formation is ready, one of them asked. The cloth is ready, the other person answered with a smile, with a gloomy laugh. Hey, it's hard to escape Kaishuan's wings in retrospect. Among the verdant mountains, two figures were waiting patiently. Tisk, Brother Seven, this time the buyer's price is really not low. In order to ensure the completion of the task, even our two gold core states are used in the building. One of them said casually, and the hidden face was an expression of surprise. The two are the powerhouses of the Heavenly Killing Tower, the gold core cultivation base. This kind of cultivation base is in the general sect, and it is enough to become the sect leader, too, and elder and the like. And even rogue cultivators are considered to be strong on one side. The heavenly killing tower can use two people, but very few. Of course, Seventh Brother said. A year ago, the major super product sect held a discussion conference. 
Jiu Kaishuan strongly suppressed other sect geniuses and won the first place. How can he be an ordinary person? Furthermore, she has a very good physique, has a brilliant inheritance, and has a smooth path to practice. In the future, she will not easily surpass you and me. So the head of our genius is quite precious. The thought of killing a genius like Jiu Kaishuan made this unknown seventh brother feel excited. As a killer, there is nothing more happier than killing a big man in the future. Yes, this kind of genius is a future's word saint, if it doesn't make trouble. Such a person is really enjoyable to kill. Another humanity. But brother seven, why are we doing this here? Why bother in this Tianhe sect, other people's territory? He was very puzzled. Why did the building ask the two of them to ambush here? There is clearly a safer place to choose. But he also knew that it was impossible for someone in the building to harm them both, they were both grasshoppers on a rope. The two of them died, and it did no good to those people. However, fighting in the Tianhe Zong is just dancing on the wire, and the two of them are killed at every turn. There is no need to come here. You don't understand this, seventh brother smiled triumphantly. Of course it's because this place is not only the best ambush location, it's also very safe. As for why, you need to ask the people of Tianhe sect. Seventh brother said with interest, and the other person was taken aback for a moment and then reacted. Fun, fun. It turns out that my family killed my family. The people of Tianhe sect are really wonderful. Suddenly, all right. As for the internal affairs of the Tianhe sect, let them make trouble by themselves. Let's just kill people and collect resources. Resources delivered to the door. Seventh brother stretched out a hand and pointed to the distance. It's already here. The two of them stared at them, and saw Jiu Kaishuan's sword flying from the sky, fascinating, like a goddess, dazzling. In the mountains, two strong killers hide in the jungle, and the Dao Yun breath does not reveal the slightest. They are like hunters, waiting quietly for their prey to enter the trap they prepared. The sharp and dangerous blade in his hand trembled slightly, as if he was thirsty for blood, and groaned silently. The figures of the two disappeared, as if into the air, a piece of transparency. On the blue sky, Jiu Kaishuan continued to fly as usual, ignorant. This time going to Lianbing Mountain was a rare relaxation activity apart from her cultivation, so she was in a good mood now. It's just that her beautiful face soon became sad again. I will go to Tiangan Cave to practice soon. If the entry time is too long, will Song Wudao's longevity directly run out after coming out? No, you must find Song Wudao more medicine pill. Let him be promoted quickly. Ji Yu Kaishuan thought that she would give Song Wudao medicine pill again if she had time, whether he wanted it or not. Hum. Suddenly, divine armament moved under his feet. Who? The Tianhe sect has a murderous heart against me, and I can't dare to eat a leopard. Ji Yu Kaishuan stood still her eyebrows furrowed, her eyes patrolled around, as if she wanted to find something out of it. But there was nothing unusual around her, which made her look more solemn. She had never encountered such a thing. Ha ha, too gloomy laughter came. It deserves to be a strong suppressor of other geniuses, this can be detected. Pity, too late. In the world, two ghost-like figures suddenly flashed, and overwhelming murderous intent overwhelmed the sky, like a ferocious ocean, to submerge Ji Kaishuan and smash it. The two figures swiftly slaughtered from different directions, without any scruples. Madness. Ji Kaishuan's eyes flickered coldly, and the flying sword under her feet was full of light, and she instantly came to the distance in front of her and collided with the two killers who came here. Amidst the sound of ping pong, flying sword, and the two fought so many times, the sword's light grew dim. And Ji Kaishuan's Taoist rhyme is also getting messy and unsustainable. How come? How can there be two gold core killers in the Tianhe sect in ambush? And sect has no response. Ji Kaishuan's heart was cold. On weekdays, there are people guarding her by her side, that is, now because she is in sect, the defense is lax. But she was taken advantage of because of this. Two figures struck, no more to think about. She chanted the mantra silently hand seals in succession with her hands, and the dress was automatically without wind, a kind of inexplicable power was born. The Dao Yun that was originally scattered on his body was forcibly gathered and rushed to flying sword. Sword Chi rises into the sky, obviously a powerful secret technique. However, 
Ji Yu Kaishuan knows herself that she is too far away from the two gold core powerhouses realm. This is only to create an opportunity to escape. Sword Ray developed like a thunderbolt, with great momentum and amazing power. In a short time, the two killers were blocked, and Ji Yu Kaishuan turned and flew away. However, in front of her, a figure suddenly flashed, and it was one of the killers. What? Ji Yu Kaishuan exclaimed, then her face was clouded. This time, she was in danger. Lianbing Mountain, casting room. Song Wu Dao, who was practicing, was suddenly startled. This Dao Yun breath, he who was promoted to the realm of soul has already given birth to a spirit. His soul is exceptionally pure, as clear and translucent as colored glaze, with an extraordinary texture. Therefore, he could easily perceive a familiar breath of Daoyun, but this Daoyun seemed very faintly disordered. And beside it, there were still two Daoist rhymes that seemed very powerful. Has a problem. What happened to Ji Yu Kaishuan? Following the source of these ray of Daoyun, Song Wu Dao's soul power spread to the distance like a tide. The power of the soul is mysterious and abnormal. Although it cannot allow him to see the world clearly as if he restores the light, it allows him to perceive the world in a unique way. In some aspects, the power of the soul is far more sensitive than other senses. Soon, in Song Wu Dao's perception, a scene that surprised him appeared. In the black and white world lacking color, the three rich Taoist rhymes are entangled with each other. Among these three Taoist rhymes, one is weak and two are strong. At this time, the three swiftly fought and collided fiercely. Under the power of the soul, a series of voices were captured by Song Wu Dao and appeared in his mind. Ji Yu Shaoniangpi, someone buys your head for your item today. You, as if to destroy Gu's last defeat, the words of the two gold core killers kept coming, wanton and arrogant. The Dao Yun, which is already weak in the air, is declining and sluggish. A ridicule came from it, Ji Yu Kaishuan's voice. Oh, dare to kill me. What about you even if you are from the heavenly slaughter tower? It won't be long, you will come to my funeral. In the weak words, although Ji Yu Kaishuan's voice lacks strength, it fully demonstrates her pride and affirmation as a super sect genius. What's more, she has two important identities to punish Elder's disciple and sect leader's direct bloodline. The Tianhe sect must investigate this matter to the end. The two gold core killers seemed to be hesitant to make a move, but they soon became fierce again. After successive offensives, Ji Yu Kaishuan suddenly let out a, wow, as if vomiting blood. And that group of weak Dao Yun also declined faster. Ji Yu Kaishuan's situation is not good. It seems that luck is not so good. Song Wu Dao soon confirmed that the declining Dao Yun belonged to Ji Yu Kaishuan, after all, she had just been here. Looks like this, Ji Yu Kaishuan was besieged by two people after she left here, but the genius of this sect in the Tianhe sect was besieged and killed, which made Song Wu Dao feel a little bit subtle. This is Tianhe sect one of the rare super sects in the world, and the genius of this sect must be very safe here. But the fact that Ji Yu Kaishuan was robbed as soon as she went out was a bit ridiculous. Um, under the light of the power of the soul, Song Wu Dao was a little surprised to see Ji Yu Kaishuan's next actions. Why did she fly far away? But Song Wu Dao quickly reacted, because he was afraid of hurting himself. Thinking of Ji Yu Kaishuan again forcing own medicine pill, Song Wu Dao couldn't help but smile. You really take care of me. Although Ji Yu Kaishuan's actions are actually superfluous, but this is also because it is inconvenient for her to disclose cultivation base. In the world of the cultivator, the human heart is treacherous and the methods are mysterious. In order to avoid causing trouble to the upper body, he can only do this. Especially he asked himself realm is still low. But, the two people who besieged Ji Yu Kaishuan didn't seem to be very strong. What happened to Ji Yu Kaishuan for a long time? Really weak. Song Wu Dao didn't know that although the people represented by the two groups of Dao Yun were no more ferocious than the little animals in his eyes, the opponent was already one of the few masters among the cultivators. The reason why Ji Yu Kaishuan has been able to hold on to the present is all because she can fight across the border, and she has a lot of treasures to protect each other. Song Wu's Dao heart moved, and the colored glaze spirit in his body bloomed with colorful mysterious light. The knives obtained from the knife saint senior bloomed and scorched, and the light circulated endlessly. There was a buzzing sound on the knife body, 
and everything around him was silent, and the magnificent and mysterious Taoist rhyme overflowed. And above the snow-white blade, a ray of sword energy was gently leaked, as if to cut the sky and split the sky and the earth. Boom! Song Wu Dao flicked the floating body of the long sword, and with a clear sword moan, the long sword was fleeting. Hey! One of the two gold core killers who was besieging Ji Yu Kaishuan smirked. Girl, you can't escape the palms of our hands. Didn't you notice that the breath here can't leak a bit? With a radius of 50 miles, we have already laid out the formation. The two assassins said to Ji Yu Kaishuan, who retreated from the battle and waited for the opportunity to flee in the distance. After the two killers reminded it, Ji Yu Kaishuan suddenly realized that she had always felt that something was wrong before, but she had no time to think about it when she was fighting. How come? How can they deploy such a large array in such a short period of time? Could it be? Wrong. A monk sect, who is going to kill me? Why? Ji Yu Kaishuan wanted to understand the joints immediately. At this time, her face was full of hatred. Even if the two are gold core masters, it is impossible to arrange a large formation covering a radius of 50 miles within a few hours. In the Tianhe sect, there must be someone who will attack her. This large array of concealing the rhyme of Taoism must be arranged with the help of someone with a heart. Her face was indescribably bitter, looking at the two gold core body assassins in front of her, and the large array around her. This is almost a deadly situation. Suddenly, her nostalgic figure flashed in her eyes, the master and relatives, but for some reason, they ended up staying on a familiar young man. Song Wu Dao, Song Wu Dao, don't you can't break into the next realm just because you don't have me to send you medicine pill. Unfortunately, I can't enjoy those quiet times with you anymore. Immediately, Ji Yu Kaishuan's eyes became full of determination. She still doesn't want to die. Waves of his hands repeatedly gave birth to many phantoms. In his body, Dao Yun once again forcibly condensed, his sword sword chi overflowed, attacking the two. Oh, overwhelmingly, court death, the two gold core killers sneered in their hearts. If Ji Yu Kaishuan had not been talented, wealthy, and extraordinary swords in hand, how could they have let her avoid the attack one after another? At this moment, she took the initiative to take the initiative, and in their eyes she was looking for a dead end. Okay, the two of us will make you perfect. Black and red blades filled the surrounding area, and the two grinned, as they waved their swords, they wanted to take Ji Yu Kaishuan's life. However, something seemed to flash in the sky at this time, and a grand and incomparable, extremely sharp and terrifying Dao Yun descended. The two froze. Kuang's face was filled with astonishment, still, two fountains of blood gushing out. The huge pain came later. How come? In the air, there was a voice that the two had made before. In the end what happened? Why is my body not obedient? The consciousness of the two people gradually blurred. At the last moment of dying, they saw two headless corpses falling from the air, blood stained in the air. The two gold cores were completely wiped out in an instant. This, Ji Yu Kaishuan on the other side was shocked and couldn't say the whole thing. The stiff muscles in her body that had just arrived because of the arrival of Dao Yun slowly eased. Who is it on earth? It's so scary. She didn't dare to recall the killing intent at that moment, the grandeur and the majesty of the world, as if there was nothing to kill. Ji Yu Kaishuan was stunned for a moment, and there seemed to be the sound of something broken in the world. The band's space was revealed instantly, and the many masters of the Tianhe sect immediately changed their colors. Who? Which fanatic? After a while, a powerful figure flew over. However, when they saw this authentic Yun Daoyi, they were all horrified. Chapter 11. In Tianhe sect, this was originally a beautiful place for sect, but because of the arrival of the sword, the vegetation was destroyed and it was messy. Powerful figures came one after another, these people stood by the void, their clothes fluttered, and looked like an immortal. However, each of the fallen figures stood silently, frowning, just realizing alone. In front of the world, the majestic and incomparable sword intent ran across the sky, and Dao Yun dissipated like a frenzy. The blue sky, leaving only the clouds to be chopped up, like a dilapidated cotton wool, makes everyone who arrives tremble in their hearts, unwilling to speak easily. However, what is even more unbelievable is that this grand sword intent is only a leftover after one shot, and it is incomplete. As soon as they imagined the complete appearance of this sword intent, their horror spread uncontrollably in their hearts. 
This piece of knife intent is simply terrible. Yes, it's rare in my life. It seems that this sword intent should be related to the Tianhe sect, and I don't know who sect did not want to be named. Everyone sighed with emotion, who can reach this level, it must be impossible for contemporary people. They were thinking about which ancestor made the move, and they gradually had a guess in their hearts. All right, at this time sect leader spoke, what is going on in this place, let Kaishuan talk about it first. Following the words of sect leader, the people who were still discussing just now calmed down and turned their attention to Ji Yu Kaishuan, who was on the first day of sect. Kaizan, you talk first, sect leader said. Ji Yu Kaishuan bowed to the many elders and said bluntly, The heavenly killing tower wants to kill me. As soon as this statement came out, everyone frowned. When Ji Yu Kaishuan explained the matter clearly, sect leader became even more furious, with frost on his face. I'm so courageous, it's the heavenly killing tower is my Tianhe sect where is it? Immediately, sect leader looked around at many elders with cold eyes. All the people who were accustomed to seeing the wind and rain quickly understood the meaning of sect leader. Why can the heavenly slaughter tower sneak in silently? Why can such a large-scale formation be arranged without everyone knowing? Generally speaking, this is absolutely impossible. Unless, they all knew the answer in their hearts, but they never wanted to think about it. The two gold core level masters sneaked into my Tianhe sect without knowing it. And there is still a chance to set up a big battle. Ah, who among you did this, someone will give me an explanation sooner or later. Sect leader vibrated his clothes, a huge storm surged between the sky and the earth, and the cultivation base of Dongxuan's seventh stage was undoubtedly revealed. Everyone's chest sank and their faces were ugly, but they didn't dare to say anything. Ji Yu Kaishuan is the most talented person in the bloodline of sect leader, and also the most talented person of Tianhe sect. In other words, sect is one of the few people most likely to take the lead in the future, and now such an important person in the door has been ambushed on the own turf, which is simply absurd. This matter is too shameful. But. Dot who did it? Now sect is in full swing, and is the first of all righteous sects. Everything goes smoothly in the door, and it is impossible to commit it, and there is no reason to do so. At this time, among the many elders, one of the handsome and young elders stood up, arched his cupped hands and said. Sect leader, in my opinion, this matter may not have been done by someone in the door. Seeing him say this, the person next to him quietly tugged the elder's arm, and then his eyes motioned to him to stop talking. Just listen to him continue to say, the world has been in peace for a long time, but only in the last hundred years. All parties have changed. Devil Dao and several other super product sects have begun to become active. The Celestial Immortals faction, the White Rainbow Sword sect, and the Ice Snow Pavilion all want to challenge my position as the first sect of the Tianhe sect. If one of them wants to kill Kaishuan to provoke suspicion among the masters of our sect, causing panic among the people, it is still unknown. Sect leader, we still need to be careful about this matter, and take a long-term view. Elder's eyes condensed, and he said that what Elder said may not be impossible. Sect has always been in a good atmosphere, and with the restrictions guarantee, it is almost impossible to harm the same clan. More likely, it was the hands of other clansmen. Sect leader did not let go, but stared at everyone coldly. At this time, the person in charge of the search just arrived, alleviating the serious atmosphere here. Sect leader, the array has been found. Having said that, the subordinates handed four flags to the sect leader, and everyone saw that the full restrictions were obviously not from the Tianhe sect's refining technique, nor from the heavenly killing tower. This seems to verify Qi Yan's words to a certain extent. Humph, sect leader's complexion is still very ugly, but this means that he has turned off. Next, many elder began to talk about the ancestors of this shot. They couldn't talk about Ji Yu Kaishuan being attacked for the time being, otherwise sect leader would get angry again, but there is no such concern about the remaining sword intent in front of him, so you can say it casually. Our ancestors of sect's use of knives are not too many. And the sword is so grand and mysterious, it seems to be one of the Taoists who specializes in swordsmanship. Everyone, I think the answer is ready to come out, it goes without saying. A certain elder who has been practicing swordsman said that when he talked about the sword intent, his admiration was so full that he almost said it. Good, brother Huang is right, 
This elder's inference was unanimously approved. And this place is indeed very close to the closed-door training of Sword Saint Senior. It should be the ancestor of sect. Someone added. On the other side, sect leader spoke. Kasheng Elder, the aftermath of this incident will be handed over to you, and the follow-up will also be handed over to you for investigation. Lu Elder, the Heavenly Slaughter Tower is so blatantly coming and ambushing, but he didn't put our Tianhe sect to put in one's eyes at all. You go here, take a few gold core lives, and let them know who you really are. When talking about killing, sect leader's expression was downplayed, as if it was not the gold core realm that killed, but just a few wild dogs. The two took their orders, and then left. Watching the back of the two of them leaving, sect leader still had flames burning in his eyes. Killing his direct descendants, his granddaughter Ji Yu Kaishuan. This matter is endless. After a while, the crowd dispersed. Only sect leader and Ji Yu Kaishuan were left here. Sect leader touched Ji Yu Kaishuan's head. Kai Zan, you have worked hard. Ji Yu Kaishuan shook her head, already relieved from the danger of being ambushed just now. It's okay, Grandpa. After comforting Ji Yu Kaishuan, Sect leader turned to the direction of Lianbing Mountain to salute respectfully and then said, Thank you ancestors for helping me to relieve Ji Yu Kaishuan's death. From then on, the ancestors have requirements, Junior will go all out. Not long afterwards, seeing that there was no response, Sect leader felt a little regretful and had to take Ji Yu Kaishuan away. It turns out that Ji Yu Kaishuan is a descendant of Sect leader. In the casting room of Bingbingshan, Song Wudao recovered the spirit power left in the area around Ji Yu Kaishuan and then said to himself, Ji Yu Kaishuan's status in sect is unusual. Ji Yu Kaishuan has never told him about this matter. This is probably because he was afraid of scruples in his heart, so I concealed it, Song Wudao heart thought. Then he shook his head and smiled, again for his good. Speaking of it, this friend is indeed worthwhile, and Ji Yu Kaishuan has always been affectionate and righteous to him. However, Song Wudao did not rashly respond to sect leader's gratitude, and then stood up for Ji Yu Kaishuan. First, he felt that sect would properly resolve the matter and prevent Ji Yu Kaishuan from being wronged. The other is that he likes to be alone in quiet cultivation. If he really shows up, he doesn't know how many things will be entangled and his life will be wasted. It would be great to have this time to climb the avenue. Now in sect, it is still impossible to rule out the possibility that someone will kill Ji Yu Kaishuan. Sect probably will be annoyed for a while. With this accident, sect's senior management shouldn't let Ji Yu Kaishuan come out easily. Song Wudao suddenly felt a little pity. Although cultivation can satisfy almost all his desires, it is also good if there is occasionally a woman with a nice voice next to him and stay with him for a period of time. For the blind Song Wudao, the voice is the human face, and Ji Yu Kaishuan's voice is soft and melodious, and she is undoubtedly a beautiful woman. And for the beauties who are friends, no one will be bored for no reason. But Song Wudao wouldn't feel lost, he just felt a little pity. Think about it, after this ambush, sect's protective measures for Ji Yu Kaishuan will inevitably be ascending to one or more levels, and he doesn't need to worry about Ji Yu Kaishuan's safety. It's just, how do these people regard me as a senior sword saint? Is it because of my sword intent, which is very similar to the sword saint senior, or is it because I don't work saber technique? What Song Wudao used just now was an ordinary change in the saber technique. The saber technique was created by the saint senior. In addition, I have obtained the understanding of the swordsmanship of the sword sage senior, and I am very similar to his sword intent, but I can't say the past. Song Wudao immediately stopped thinking about it. If you misunderstood, just misunderstand it, so that he didn't bother to make up nonsense and explain to sect how the cultivation base came from. I really hope to get to the gold core realm soon. Song Wudao said softly. After this breakthrough, his body was condensed with spirits, and his perception of own became clearer. He has a hunch that as long as he can step into the gold core realm, he will have a chance to transform. This is also the only chance he has to repair his body under the sky. If I miss this time, I don't know how long it will take to cure his natural crippling disease. In the Tianhe sect, the days passed day by day. Because of Ji Yu Kaishuan's attack, the Tianhe sect had a rectification movement, and after that, the Tianhe sect fell into long-term peace. 
Eighty years of time passed quietly, sneaking away like no one had noticed. In the past eighty years, Lianbing Mountain has been completely silent and has become a former site. The great cause of the Tianhe family, the rise of one line of inheritance, and the loneliness of one line of inheritance are very common and did not cause any violent reactions in sect. At most, when some cultivator recalled the past, or watched the sect record, I felt a sentence or two. Finally reached the peak of the soul. It took a lot of effort. Song Wudao stood up and moved his body after dusting off the dust that had naturally fallen from sitting still for a long time. Compared with before, this time cultivation base has grown very slowly. He shook his head, as if a little dissatisfied and a little helpless. This is to let others know, even if a peerless genius like Ji Yu Kaishuan knows, he will only think that he is cheap and behaved, and then envy and hate him with a combination of tricks. However, Song Wudao was wrong, he was only real, and he felt slow, which made him a little unbearable. But this realm has passed. Divine soul is not good for cultivation, this is generally accepted. In this realm, every ascension first stage realm takes 40 years to go up, and this is the speed of a rare genius. But here in Song Wudao, this limit was easily broken. This is not only because the system has provided him with peerless cultivation technique and a large amount of resources. To have this result, Song Wudao's efforts are equally important. Because of his blindness, Song Wudao lacks pleasure in doing many things, but the growth of the cultivation base during cultivation is real and clearly visible. So for a long time, Song Wudao has a close instinctive love for cultivation. For this reason, his cultivation speed does not seem so strange. In fact, if all goes well, Song Wudao can even cultivate to the world. However, it seems that I need to expand the scope of sign in. Song Wudao said with some depression, scratching his head. The long sign in period made it difficult for Song Wudao to continue to get anything valuable from Lianbing Mountain. But fortunately, I have been cultivating since I came to Refining Mountain, and I haven't seen it out of Refining Mountain. It's time to relax. Eighty years later, Song Wudao, who had reached the pinnacle of his soul, had already undergone earth shaking changes in his strength. Even he himself didn't know where his own strength was. However, he is confident that he will not let others find out about himself and cause troubles, and he will be able to accomplish what he wants to do. His mind moved slightly, and Song Wudao's figure disappeared. At the same time, Tianhe sect showed up an unnoticeable figure, touring around in sect. Ding! Congratulations to the host, the signing is successful, and the knife is completely solved. Quote dot 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 quote. Ding! Congratulations to the host! Congratulations to the host! The voice kept ringing in my ears. Congratulations to the host, you have successfully signed in and obtained the magic magic. Making demons, Song Wudao said to himself. Signing in at sect these few days has enabled him to get a lot of good things. As long as you sacrifice the demons you have killed yourself, can you grow the cultivation base? Knives and tools are unknowable, a sophisticated method of forging a knife is far better than relying on my own groping to forge a tool. Time flowed slowly, and Song Wudao did not rush to sign in the Tianhe sect, but the more he signs in, the more things make him puzzled. There are so few people in Tianhe sect. No, there are also fewer strong people here. It seems that something major has happened, causing many people to be absent. Song Wudao shook his head. As long as it wasn't something that shakes the foundation of sect, it has nothing to do with him. And if such a thing happens, he will do his part for sect. Just as Song Wudao doubts, Eastern Wasteland. The vegetation here is sparse and the vitality is mixed, which is obviously not a good place for general cultivation techniques. A barren mountain. Many super product sects, under the leadership of Tianhe sect, are carrying out a rare siege in the world. Originally as planned, it was about to succeed. A terrible accident happened unexpectedly. After a day, all the forces in the world who have received the news are all boiling. In all directions, a piece of news spread wildly. The world's number one righteous superpower, Tianhe sect leader, Ji Yu Changming. In the battle of slaying the devil, we will die with the demon of heaven. As soon as the news came out, the major forces couldn't believe it. They couldn't imagine that the sect leader of the Tianhe sect would die in the eastern wasteland. For a time, the world was in an uproar. Tianhe sect, everyone looked sad. 
The punishment with a sullen face elder sighed as he looked at the tearful apprentice Ji Yu Kaishuin in front of him. Kai Zan, sorry. Ji Yu Kaishuin did not speak, tears on her face were streaming silently, her family members and elders all died for sect, and her parents had already left her. Now there is only one grandfather who holds the post of sect leader, but they are also leaving. She left. Kai Zan, good boy, I have suffered you. Punishment elder touched Ji Yu Kai Zan's head and comforted. Thinking back to the battle that day, penalty elder couldn't help but hate his incompetence. At that time, the demon head suddenly went crazy, regardless of his own injuries, and then exploded himself. In the end, if sect leader hadn't discovered it in time, the consequences would be unpredictable. The powerhouses who participated in the siege together might be lost in this matter. But now, all of them have been saved. But after that, there are still a lot of follow-up effects. First of all, the position of the current sect leader of the Tianhe sect is suspended. He is certain that although there are definitely many people in the clan who are sad because of sect leader, many people must have other thoughts. Originally, according to the previous discussion with sect leader, she planned to let Ji Yu Kaishuin cultivate to the Gold Core realm, so she gave her the responsibility of sect leader. Only now, sect leader died because of an accident, protecting everyone. If we recommend Ji Yu Kaishuin in this way, using the cultivation base at the pinnacle of the Ji Yu Kaishuin Foundation building, I'm afraid it will arouse criticism. Master, Grandpa died like this. My parents also died for sect. They are all dead. Ji Yu Kaishuin suddenly raised her head, tears flickering in her eyes, looking straight at Punishment Elder, and said. I hate sect, I hate them doing this for sect, one by one sacrifice. Elder wanted to comfort him, but he didn't think of a good way. At this time, the tears in Ji Yu Kaishuin's eyes suddenly became more turbulent, as if the gate was opened, and they kept flowing down, and she quickly wiped it with her hands. But I can't give up. This is the career they have worked hard for all their lives. I can't give up. Ji Yu Kaishuin cried out, and the words in her mouth turned into ambiguous sobbing. She squatted down like a child who had lost her home, holding her legs, crying more and more intensely until her throat was swollen and sore. Penalty Elder guarded Ji Yu Kaishuin, silent. After a long time, Ji Yu Kaishuin's cry stopped. Master, I want to become a sect leader. Ji Yu Kaishuin's voice was very dull. I must go and inherit their business. Penalty Elder was stunned for a moment. Unexpectedly, the child was stronger and more responsible than he thought. Good, Elder agreed. As a teacher, I will try my best to help you. Ji Yu Kaishuin replied dully, then stood up her expression gradually returning to normal. After a few words of exhortation, the penalty elder turned and left. He was going to persuade other elders to let Ji Yu Kaishuin inherit the position of sect leader. In penal elder's view, Ji Yu Kaishuin herself is a rare favorite of sect. Although she is still young, her future is very bright. The sect leader family all sacrificed because of sect, which left a huge legacy for Ji Yu Kaishuin. In addition, Ji Yu Chengming made it possible for Ji Yu Kaishuin to become the sect leader. On the premise of paving the way, it should not be too difficult for these elders to agree to Ji Yu Kaishuin's inheritance as the sect leader. Although there is a big hidden danger after this, the boat will naturally straighten up to the bridge. With Ji Yu Kaishuin's performance just now, it is very likely that she will stick to it and become a sect leader who convinces others. However, beyond the penalty elder expected, there was an accident in this matter. Three days later, Elder said in unison that he passed the test of the blue sky and river, and broke the gold core, Realm went to a higher level, and returned as a powerful person in the cave. Suddenly, many elders began to waver. After all, Ji Yu Kaishuin is too young to be an important task. The loss of sect leader by Tianhe sect this time is a big loss, and sect cannot be allowed to decline. It's not too late to wait until Ji Yu Kaishuin realm arrives, and then rerunning for the position of sect leader with Qi Elder. Everyone talked about the sect leader's position and the pros and cons of sect in turn. At this time, Elder said, Now sect has lost a lot due to the encirclement and suppression of the demon, and the death of sect leader has made everyone panic. Since it is said that Elder can pass through the blue sky, and break into the cave profound realm, then he can definitely abbot sect's overall situation, so that sect will not decline. Two elders said in the same way. For all the time, 
people who can pass Bilawodian have the qualifications to run for sect leader. I think Qi Yan should be allowed to serve as sect leader at this time of crisis. Afterwards, most elders agreed to Qi Yan as the sect leader after negotiation, and then began to persuade elder to disagree with the penalty. Under the persuasion of everyone, penalty elder felt that the development of the matter was a bit weird, but didn't think much about it, and finally agreed. After all, he is no longer in high authority, and he can't refute everyone's decision by himself. In the end, Qi Yan held the coronation ceremony of the new sect leader seven days later and became the contemporary sect leader of the Tianhe sect. The first thing Qi Yan did after becoming sect leader was to send Ji Yu Kaishuan to the Kang Bone Plain to perform the task. The Kang Bone Plain was a natural and dangerous place. After entering it, he would die for nine years. So when he heard the news, Penalty Elder directly found the same words and spoke against it. However, Qi Yan insisted on the task for the sake of better practice and tempering. He also promised that Ji Yu Kaishuan could carry the sect heavy equipment to protect her body, and forced Ji Yu Kaishuan to go to the Kang Bone Plain. On a lonely, towering and steep cliff, Song Wudao stood quietly, his robe moving in the wind. Ding, congratulations to the host, you have successfully signed in and obtained the great Tibetan void art. Song Wudao looked through it. It was a clever way to hide his figure and the aura of Taoism. It's time to go back, he said to himself. At this time, he did not know that a major change had occurred in the Tianhe sect. So he felt relieved and walked back. Blue sky and white clouds, Song Wudao leapt high in the sky, flying back. Far away, he seemed to be able to feel the heat emitted by the lava in the casting chamber. If I haven't been out for too long, I'm still a little uncomfortable this time. But it turns out that it's like this outside. It's a bit different from what Ji Yu Kaishuan described. Before, he heard Ji Yu Kaishuan say that all kinds of demon in the outside world are ready to move, and he can often see the demon in the cholera world. However, when Song Wudao went out this time, he even saw the shadow of a demon. He wanted to experiment with the newly obtained Falun Dafa, but he never had a chance. This is a magic formula that Song Wudao obtained when he signed in before. It is said that it can grow the cultivation base with the monsters killed by himself. It is very wonderful. It seems that I can only talk about it later. Song Wudao said regretfully. In fact, the reason why Song Wudao did not encounter demon was not because Ji Yu Kaishuan described the error, but because there was a specific reason. Recently, led by the Tianhe sect, the major forces began to encircle and suppress demon in large quantities, which made demon choose to avoid the edge of these sects and hid for a period of time. Coupled with Song Wudao's sign in process like wandering around, it was natural not to encounter a monster. Speaking of which, the benefits of going out this time are not small. It is estimated that after a few days of meditation at ease, you will be able to try to break through to the gold core state. Gold core, the opportunity that has been waiting for 80 years has finally come. I don't know if it can make up for my disability. Hope I can do what I want. Probably because of the success of Song Wudao's cultivation, he has been able to calm down a lot about the illness of the disabled, although this is still a stubborn illness in his heart. In midair, Song Wudao stretched his body, letting go of perception, and naturally experienced the world. The blurry black and white of the sky and the earth are reflected in his soul. He was looking forward to it. Maybe a few days later, when he looks at this world, it will look different. At that time, I don't know what the difference will be. In the Tianhe sect, the sky is blue and the white clouds are pure and flawless. In the quietly flowing breeze, Song Wudao is like a ghost that does not exist, passing by the various magnificent buildings of sect, and the beautiful scenery of the fairy house. But no one noticed. This is actually the result of his sign-in, the great Tibetan imaginary technique. This spell is unexpectedly useful. Song Wudao guessed that the grade of this magic formula was probably similar to that of the monster sword tactics, and it exceeded the level of the cultivation world. Lianbingshan, somewhere in the casting room. Song Wudao returned here again, unexpectedly feeling a long absence. But soon, he cleared his emotions, calmed down, prepared for cultivation, and then tried to break through. Suddenly, um, the moment when Lotus Position sat down, Song Wudao noticed something wrong. He immediately put down his cultivation and turned to the power of the soul to stretch out. This is the breath of a monster. 
This is really Lu Anwaming. I wanted to meet a monster before, but I didn't touch it at all. Now I give up, but instead feel it. Song Wudao laughed secretly, feeling the wonder of the world. It's just that, how come there are monsters in the Tianhe sect? And it doesn't seem to be imprisoned. Dao Yun's aura is sluggish, quite vigorous, and it is estimated that realm is also very superb. Song Wudao shook his head, somehow he didn't understand. As the Tianhe sect, which is known as the first righteous way, this is something that shouldn't happen. Or is it because the old stern thing happened again, and another monster broke out? After thinking about it, Song Wudao didn't want anyone to be injured because of it. Therefore, the power of his soul followed this Daoyun breath all the way to perceive, and finally found the source of this Daoyun. Very well, I didn't find me. Song Wudao calmly observed the other party to see what was going on. This, how could it be an individual? Furthermore, with the unique cultivation technique Dao Yun of the Tianhe sect, it seems that he has cultivated to a very high level. It's a traitor in sect. Song Wudao smiled and played with the taste. It seems that this person with devilish energy is at least an elder in Tianhe sect. With his perception, Song Wudao affirmed that this person had not only been to the vicinity of Refining Soldier Mountain, but had also come with sect leader at the time, among the many elders who discussed the ambush of Ji Yu Kaishuan. Traitors have appeared in sect. It seems that Ji Yu Kaishuan said that this world is not peaceful, which is indeed correct. This person's hiding is really deep enough, I didn't even distinguish the magical rhyme of this person before. I can find out now that it's because of the magical magic method that makes me sensitive to the rhyme of the magic things. Song Wudao's face moved, and he wondered why he was able to distinguish the Taoist rhyme of the monster this time. Later, in order to prevent this person from having accomplices in sect, he expanded the coverage of the god tier soul power and searched all the sites of sect. If Tianhe sect does not live well, then his retreat life here will also be broken. This is not good, Song Wudao has no plans to change places for cultivation. The power of the soul is covered, and after most of the search has passed, when he originally planned to have no harvest, he unexpectedly found one again. It really does. And cultivation base is equally good, neither of them is under the cave profound realm. Under Song Wudao's perception, these were two figures standing in different directions. One of the two figures was hidden deeper than the other. If he hadn't searched carefully, one of them might have been ignored. Oh, are they really accomplices? It looks like they will meet soon. I don't know what these two people are going to do. Song Wudao looked curious, this is something he has rarely seen since he started practicing Taoism. Continue to monitor through the soul. Somewhere in the Tianhe sect, not a sparsely populated place, the two met in an upright manner, and no one noticed it. Yeah, in the black and white world, Song Wudao was limited by the sickness of the disabled, and could only see two fuzzy figures. However, it can be concluded through the voice that the person who speaks is very old. It's me, father. Another young voice sounded. The coronation of the sect leader has passed. Two days later, it will be time to take over the destiny of the Tianhe sect. Having said this, the young voice seemed a little excited. Suddenly, Song Wudao recalled the master of this voice, who had previously opposed that someone in sect wanted to kill Ji Yu Kaishuan. Thanks for your hard work over the years, Yunur. Unexpectedly, this time it would be so simple to succeed. Be patient, he he, two days later, it's time for us to achieve great deeds. The old voice seemed to tremble with excitement. Yunur, remember, you can't let go of your vigilance yet. These days, it seems that Ji Yu Kaishuan's master has already noticed something about making the rod and penalizing elder. I have never given up on tracing you. Among the two, the person with an old voice exhorted. Yes, father. Qi Yan replied. Father, don't worry, I have been cautious in these two days. I believe that even if penal elder is allowed to investigate, nothing will be found. After using the real monster's special ability to lure the big demon to go mad, all the evidence has been wiped out by me, and now no one can think that this is what I did. Even if you can guess something, there can only be no evidence. What's more, Ji Yu Chengming, the only sect leader who has doubts about us, has also been killed by us. So even if they check it again, they will just turn around. Qi Yan said, his tone was very positive and seemed extremely confident. And what he meant was that Ji Yu Chengming, 
the sect leader of the Tianhe sect, did not simply die in battle. His death was caused by the harm of two people. All of this is in the plan of the two. Speaking of this, Qi Yan seems a little uncomfortable. Ah, if it wasn't for Ji Yu Kaishuan's failure to follow our plan, she died obediently. Why do we have to spend so much time to get the position of sect leader? Ji Yu Kaishuan died, heir to sect leader, who is it? With that, he seemed to grind his teeth. Yunur, don't be impatient. The old voice said. Who would have thought that for so many years, Sword Saint closed door training, a person who has been silent for a long time, is still alive. In the face of these old antiques who should have been in the coffin long ago, but have not entered, we must be more careful. They must have already set foot in the realm of heaven. And Tianhe sect, there are still a lot of people like this. Qi Yan's father exclaimed. After hearing this, Qi Yan seemed to calm down. Okay, father, I will be very careful. He hammered his chest lightly, making a dull noise, as if swearing. For the sake of God, I will never let our plans for many years be burned. It seems that because of the formation around them, the two of them are not worried that these words will be overheard. In fact, this big formation is indeed tight enough that even the rare powerhouses who have already stepped into the sky can hardly hear anything outside the formation. It's just that God is not on the side of the two of them. Song Wudao met this secret meeting, and he heard it easily. It seems that the two have done a lot of bad things. In the casting room, Song Wudao said with emotion. Who could have expected that sect, the most upright way, was harmed by the evil spirits hidden in the door when it was still in its heyday? Even sect leader Ji Yu Chengming was killed. Thinking about it, the last time it was related to sect leader, it was 80 years ago when he saved Ji Yu Kaishuan's life, when sect leader misunderstood that he was a saint of swordsman, so he saluted the saint of swordsman senior. And this time I heard the news of sect leader again, it was actually about his death. The world is unpredictable. Speaking of which, sect leader is still Ji Yu Kaishuan's grandfather, and I don't know how she is now. Furthermore, according to this Qi Yan, he arranged for Ji Yu Kaishuan to be killed in ambush 80 years ago. These two people are really a disaster. Song Wudao frowned, and the long sword beside him suddenly buzzed. He has already acted murderously. Not only for his friend Ji Yu Kaishuan, but also because he is full of disgust, even spurning, against such people who do evil for no reason. At this moment, the Qi Yan father and son in the formation discussed matters again. Yunur, have you collected all the things I asked you to collect? Qi Yan's father said, his tone of voice unspeakably serious. Back to my father, except for the disabled, they have all been collected. Next, Qi Yan's words were embarrassing. It's just this disabled person. It's too rare. In 80 years, I have only found five people. The rest, I still don't know what to do. Qi Yan's father was silent for a moment, seeming to be thinking. Are those few days disabled still alive? Yes, Qi Yan replied immediately. To watch them, they are very important. I understand, father. In this case, then you go to Refining Soldier Mountain now. Refining Soldier Mountain. Qi Yan was a little puzzled. Have you forgotten Ji Yu Kaishuan's blind friend? Qi Yan seemed to suddenly realize, I see. Father. Can, when we found the catalog of the true god, didn't we check it out? The blind man was long gone. Hey, the old voice suddenly let out a sigh. Afterwards, I thought about it carefully. It should be that the blind man was dead and buried in the ground, so we didn't find it. Now that there is a need, just to dig out his body, it can still play a lot of role. The two were quiet for a moment, seeming to regret the matter. Trash, Qi Yan cursed, he seemed quite resentful. Can't you live longer, incompetent things? Okay, go quickly, Qi Yan's father urged. Bring back that waste bones quickly. At Lianbing Mountain, Song Wudao perceives the two in shock. This, I just had a murderous intention on them just now, now I'm here. This is enough to live, right? Moreover, these two people are too abnormal, even the bones of others have to be used, which is far more than a miser. Fortunately, he didn't really die, and he was very strong. Otherwise, they really fall into the hands of the two, and they may not decide how to torture themselves. Sect leader is good. I have seen sect leader. I have seen sect leader. On the way to Refinery Mountain, the disciples who came across Qi Yan and Elder All greeted him. These people looked at Qi Yan with respect. 
After the fall of the old sect leader, Qi Yan officially became the sect leader of the Tianhe sect. At this time of turbulent wind and rain and the replacement of the old and the new, Qi Yan is their backbone, and he naturally respects him from the heart. Moreover, Qi Yan's own reputation is very good on weekdays, which adds a layer of charming brilliance to his body. Qi Yan nodded lightly in response, and after a while, he came to the sky above Lianbing Mountain. It has been a long time since no one has come to this mountain. It has been truly barren, and it is naturally quiet at this time. It would be nice if I knew the usefulness of the Tiancho. Otherwise, you have to raise this waste. Qi Yan seemed to regret it. On his body, the power of the soul was like the ripples of water, spreading, and through numerous obstacles, he wanted to look for it in Lianbing Mountain. Suddenly, he looked startled, revealing an inexplicable expression of surprise. The power of the soul came back, and in an ordinary casting room, he suddenly saw a figure with closed eyes meditating safely. Looking at his face, it is Ji Yu Kaishuan's blind friend. Suddenly, he shouted, Found it! Found it! After seeing Song Wudao through the power of the soul, Qi Yan shouted in surprise, but then he realized that something was wrong. This blind man is not dead. How can it be? Because he had to calculate Ji Yu Kaishuan, he had carefully collected information about Ji Yu Kaishuan 80 years ago. According to his estimation, the blind man in front of him should have died long ago as his father said. But now, Song Wudao couldn't refute it, and he appeared in front of him alive. It shouldn't be, or say. He suddenly remembered that Ji Yu Kaishuan liked to run here very much before, and apart from her hard cultivation, she only had such an important friend. And the blind man in front of him, although he is a natural disabled person, has extremely low talent, but if he has a large amount of medicine pill infused, he can still cultivate to realm and live for a hundred years. Thinking of this, I wanted to laugh, Gu's family was really kind to him. A few days ago, Ji Yu Chengming gave him the position of sect leader, and now Ji Yu Kaishuan has sent him an undamaged celestial handicapped person. This is simply God's help for his great cause. However, his expression changed quickly after he laughed, and his face became confused again. If my father didn't find the blind man when he was investigating, he could still use the blind man to travel a long distance to explain. What about realm now? Under Qi Yan's perception, now Song Wudao's realm did not rise but fell instead. Not only did it not rise into the transcendence realm, but it was similar to ordinary people. This is a little weird. A cultivator, even if realm degenerates and declines, there will always be traces of cultivation, but now Song Wudao is like a blank piece of paper, as if he had never cultivated. Coupled with the fact that he can live beyond the limit of more than a hundred years, this is even more confusing. Forget it, if you want to do so much, can you just catch this blind man and torture him? If you have any questions, you will know if you don't ask. The blind man in front of him must have a secret, but no matter how big this secret is, he is no bigger than him. Can he escape the palm of own hand after more than a hundred years of cultivation? Looking at Song Wudao in front of him, Qi Yan stretched out one palm and grasped the emptiness with five fingers. Between the sky and the earth, the wind moved from all directions, and a large handprint formed by the gathering of vitality instantly condensed. With open palms, five fingers are like mountains, the texture is all over, as if catching the sun and the moon, Chao Song Wudao is crushing down. Qi Yan smiled, success is already in sight. In the casting room, beside the rolling lava pool, Song Wudao, who was sitting quietly cross-legged, suddenly tilted his face toward him, his eyes covered with eyelids seemed to be looking at him. This feeling, as if he had been discovered long ago. What? Qi Yan's eyes suddenly tightened, and the prey that was waiting to be captured in his field of vision has disappeared. And under the cover of Divine Soul, no trace can be found either. The people who were still here before clearly exist, but now disappear out of thin air like ghosts and gods. There was a bad feeling in his heart. Who are you looking for? A chilly voice sounded behind Qi Yan, and his whole body was agitated. Who? He shouted loudly. Just like instinct, his body couldn't stop shaking, exactly the same as his reaction when he met an old monster of the heavenly pass. What the hell is this? Who? Song Wudao showed a sneer at the corner of his mouth, but his voice became very cold. I also want to ask who you are. Seeing that the other party didn't do anything immediately, 
Qi Yan turned around boldly, but there was a figure that he did not expect. Blind, he said in shock. He saw the blind man disappear just now, and after adding what happened afterwards, he thought it was the person behind the blind who had acted and protected him. Where did I think that the unpredictable man was actually this blind man? Recalling the instinctive reaction of his body just now, he concluded that the blind man in front of him was not simple, maybe he had the ability to threaten his life, this is not uncommon in the cultivator world with many adventures. And let a blind man with bad aptitude threaten him, indicating that this blind man must have encountered great opportunities. And this opportunity, the blind man in front of him does not deserve to have it, he should control it by himself. Qi Yan rolled his eyes, put on an upright official frame, raised his belt, and said loudly. Ah, little blind man, do you know who I am? I am the sect leader of the Tianhe sect. Say, what opportunity did you get in refining Soldier Mountain? In Tianhe sect, it is a big crime to conceal an opportunity and not report it. Qi Yan who is a fake tiger. Since the blind man in front of him can threaten him, he doesn't need to fight him with strength. He has the identity of the sect leader of the Tianhe sect, and the blind people in front of him eat and cultivate are supported by sect. From birth to now, he has been living in sect. It is impossible for him to be afraid of himself as the sect leader. As for concealing the opportunity and not reporting the guilt, it's just that he arbitrarily talked about it. Whether he is guilty or not, it is not his sect leader who has the final say. Song Wudao twitched the corners of his mouth, thinking that he could say one, two or three, but in the end he used the name of sect leader to suppress himself. This man is not stupid at all, but he likes to find death too much. It seems that you have to force you to answer me. Song Wudao said, preparing to do it. Hearing the off-string meaning in Song Wudao's words, Qi Yan's expression changed. It seems that the questioning is no longer good, so it can only be hard. Start first to be strong, then start to suffer. Behind him, vast oceans and blue waves converge, forming a monstrous sea, trying to press the sky. Immediately after waving his hands, the terrifying boundless ocean suppressed Song Wudao. If you don't see the Yellow River, don't give up. Song Wudao sneered. As if feeling the master's call, the long knife buzzed, and the cold knife rang across the mountains. The dreadful Dao Dao rhyme is diffused, thousands of swords are blooming, and they want to tear the world apart. Cut. After a sound, the monstrous waves were separated instantly, turned into vitality and dissipated, revealing the same body after being in the ocean. The light of the knife seemed to descend from the sky, clear and white, with nothing to stop. Shit. A huge wound appeared on Qi Yan, from his left shoulder to his hip bone. For a moment, Qi Yan's Taoist rhyme was extremely messy, and his vitality was difficult to boost. The clothes were even more blood-stained, and it was clear that the huge bone wounds came from a heart-piercing pain. There was a cold sweat on his forehead, feeling this unforgettable but familiar sword intent, his pupils suddenly shrank. The Saint of Swords. No, it's not right. This sword intent is only in the same line as the sword intent that saved Ji-Yu Kaishuan 80 years ago, but if there is one, it is not. In fact, this is only because Song Wudao is more diligent in the sword. At the moment of crisis, Qi Yan's brain is running fast, and time seems to be slowed down at this moment. Little blind man can't be a saint. The little blind man got a great opportunity in Lianbingshan. The heart is beating. An idea appeared spontaneously. The chance of the blind is the saint of swords. He must have been accepted as a disciple by the saint who had just left the pass. A peerless figure who crossed the world can teach such a disciple. Not surprising. On this occasion, great cause matters, and he can't offend the other party. You must not leave the saint to appear. The wound on his body healed in a blink of an eye, and he saluted his cupped hands and shouted loudly. The saint heir to the sword. How offended, let this matter go. After speaking, Qi Yan's body shape changed sharply and turned into a divine light to escape. In Qi Yan's view, he is a sect master. Even if the opponent is a disciple of Sword Saint, he has made a mistake first, but he has been injured by him. What he did just now is enough to give the opponent a face. So he felt that the matter should have passed, and the two sides have since revealed it. To be honest, if he weren't worried about bringing out the old pervert, old antique, who had overwhelmed the world's tycoons, he wouldn't have let Song Wudao go, and even bowed down and apologized immediately. 
However, an unexpected voice suddenly exploded behind him. Who, allowed you to go? Seeing the back of Tiantian fleeing in the distance, Song Wudao shook his head. Just now, in order to avoid making a heavy shot, he missed and killed the opponent, so the power of the sword light would be so weak. Unexpectedly, Qi Yan got a chance to escape. It seems that this time you can't pay too much attention to proportions. With the arm raised, the blade's body gleamed, and it was as bright as colored glaze for a moment. The sky, like a sign, the layers of white clouds split apart, as the light of the knife cut down, breaking like cotton wool. Then there was the wind. The wind connecting the world was cut off, and a wall of sharp sword aura appeared in the world. Oops, the words of frantic fleeing went wild. That incredibly terrifying knife light aura is about to come. A thought of life and death. That blind man, really want to kill him. Fight it. Qi Yan stopped, now he can't worry about whether he will reveal his identity and affect his accomplishment of his great cause. His life is the most important. A strong regret was born in his heart. He shouldn't have come to this place. He shouldn't even see this blind man. The facial muscles were twisted, and Qi Yan's expression became more and more ferocious. This thing is going to push him to this point. The stinky blind man deserves a million to death, and a thousand cuts are not enough to vent his hatred. Dare to ruin my great cause. Qi Yan's clothes suddenly split open, and the roads seemed to come from the netherworld, with a frightening aura surrounding them intertwined. It seems to contain great horror. With the unanimous shout, the devilish energy rushed and gathered, like a chain of tentacles, bound to the light of the sword. No one would have imagined that the first sect leader of the upright path was actually like this in essence. His figure suddenly grew bigger, and he was already ten feet in a blink of an eye. Realm on the body has risen even more, directly from Dongshuan first stage to the top. Boy, I want to put your head on the altar of the true god. The harsh words shouted, a big black axe appeared in Qi Yan's hand, and the black magic energy slashed towards the light of the knife. At this time, Qi Yan, who was intoxicated in power, seemed to see the scene of victory, and he laughed wildly. I am invincible, ha ha ha. However, in the next second, his face froze directly. Under the sword light that slashed the sky and the earth, his confident and invincible power was extremely fragile, and disappeared in the blink of an eye, and the black big axe in his hand fell apart in an instant. A bright blade of light flashed. Qi Yan's expression was stunned, he split into two diagonally, the sword energy instantly penetrated into his soul body, and his life stayed at this moment. In the broken body, black magic Qi surged towards Song Wudao, turning into pure vitality and being absorbed by Song Wudao. Yes, it's a little closer to the gold core realm. He smiled. The situation just now belonged to the magical effect of the demon transformation Dafa, and the demon transformation Dafa was indeed worthy of the name of the demon transformation. After transformation, more than half of the demon Qi in Qi Yan's body was absorbed by him. Because these vitality is too heavy, even most of them could not be transformed by him immediately, but stored in the body. Of course, the function of this storage is also part of the Falun Dafa. However, the amount of vitality he has gained may also be due to Qi Yan's true demonic body and extremely high quality of demonic energy. Then Song Wudao frowned. He didn't expect this guy to be killed by him so easily. Originally, the reason why he was here waiting for Qi Yan's arrival was because he was afraid that he would not notice when he met Qi Yan and his son, allowing one of the two to escape in a very short gap using transfer formation. Both of them are sect seniors, and they may not have such a rare treasure. However, Song Wudao did not expect that the other party was so weak. Before, he couldn't handle it well, so he didn't seriously injure the other party, so that the other party could escape. But after adding some power for the second time, he was killed by such a simple one. Fortunately, he also wanted to interrogate and obtain some other information. Song Wu was very disgusted in Dao's heart, and even said that he was a true demon, and that he was in the Dongxuan realm, which was too weak. It seems that I can only find another person. Song Wu Dao looked in a certain direction of the Tianhe sect, and the power of the soul was observing the other side through the mountains. At this time, the other party seemed to be sitting quietly, and did not notice the movement here. Is it because I was too self-confident, so the power of the soul did not come over, or was it because the power of the soul was condensed because of the scruples of other people in sect? But fortunately, this one did not run away. 
With the previous experiment, this time I should be able to control the strength. Song Wudao shook the handle of the knife and said to himself, Well, I should be able to control, right? Tianhe sect, Kangming Tower, in a lofty mountain range. The stream is clear, the ancient trees are towering to the sky, the monkeys are howling, and the yellow cranes are humming. The father of Qi Yan in the pavilion is sitting quietly on the futon. He was holding an ancient book with a yellowish color in his left hand, and a cup of freshly brewed tea in his right hand. The color of the water in the cup is clear and full of vitality, showing the noble identity of the owner here. But what he said in his mouth was completely irrelevant. Yunur, are you back? Did you bring back the bones of that little blind man? In the corridor, Song Wudao's footsteps sounded. At this time, the father of Qi Yan seemed to be still strange. Yunur, what do you do to hide Dao Yun breath? For your father, you don't need to be so cautious anymore. The father of Qi Yan had just finished speaking, and there was a sound of heavy objects falling into the room. Boom, Qi Yan's body fell, and Song Wudao's voice appeared. Is that what you said? The father of Qi Yan looked at the corpse of Qi Yan that had been split in half before his eyes in astonishment, and immediately stared at Song Wudao with uncontrollable anger. How dare you! In the room, a bright and flawless knife light appeared. Almost at the same time, Somewhere in the elder immortal cave of the Tianhe sect, Qi Sheng quietly meditated on cultivation. Suddenly, his body was full of vitality, and Dao Yun became stronger and stronger after a rise and fall. The body's momentum also became stronger. Call. Finally the gold core ninth stage. Qi Sheng opened his eyes and smiled. I must tell my uncle this news as soon as possible, thanks to my uncle's point, otherwise I don't know it will take a few years to get this understanding. With that, Qi Shengfei left. And his uncle is the father of Qi Yan. Kangming Tower, after a half Zhushang time. All the sounds of fighting, inquiries, and broken porcelain in the room all disappeared. As if everything had settled down, there was only a dead silence left in this attic. And the father of Qi Yan at the pinnacle of Dongxuan, there is only one corpse left. The victory belonged to Song Wudao, but he shook his head dissatisfied and sighed casually. It looks like we will find some means to extract a confession next time. Otherwise, if you fool around like this, you won't get any important results. Song Wudao picked up a black atlas in his hand and looked at it. This is a rare gain. The picture book is the picture book of the true God from the words of the father and son Qian before. Listening to the tone of the two people, this should be a very important thing. It's just that the state of this volume of atlas is very strange now. Song Wudao opened it, and there was nothing in it except for the deep black, as if a paper page containing something. But it was inexplicable, making Song Wudao feel disgusted and even nauseous. He tried to find out how to use it. As a result, Song Wudao didn't get the method to use, so he put this atlas aside first. Recalling the experience just now, in general, apart from killing two people this time, Song Wudao used the demonic energy of the two to further grow the cultivation base, only to obtain a volume of atlas with unknown usage and some scattered information. But the scattered information is also very useful. The information was obtained from the dead Qi Yan's father. It was a jumble of records, which was kept personally by Qi Yan's father. From these records, it can be inferred that Qi Yan's father is not a born monster. It was only after being immersed by magical intent when deep into dangerous places in the early years, and after being baptized by magical Dao Yun, did it become what it is today. Since then, his heart has changed drastically, which has caused the current father of Qi Yan to no longer be regarded as the original person. And many years later, Qi Yan was born. It may be because Qi Yan's father was born with demon blood, Qi Yan was discovered by his father as a real demon body when he was born. Over time, Qi Yan grew up safely under the blessing of his father, and even became an important figure in sect. In the past hundred years, it was Ji Yu Kaishuan and sect leader who had fought hard for the two. The reason is not because of power, but because they have just obtained the catalogue of the true gods that has not been too long. However, Song Wudao didn't know for the time being what the role of the true god catalogue was and how to open it. What is the relationship between the True God Catalog and the Tiancho? Song Wudao thought about it. Compared with the experience of the two, he was obviously more concerned about the news of the disabled, after all, it had something to do with him. In thinking, 
Song Wudao's figure had left Kangming Tower unknowingly. Under his inadvertent observation of the power of the soul, a figure that seemed to have joy on his face, just after he left, entered the Kangming Tower. Then, Tianhe sect once again ushered in a violent turbulence that shook sect up and down. The father of Qi Yan, the previous generation of sect who stood proudly in the world, is too sacred to Elder Qishan. Fallen, Kangming Tower, received a subpoena, and many elders gathered here with serious expressions. The situation was serious, no one dared to make a sound, and the surroundings seemed to be quiet as if the voice of Yiluo could be heard. The power of the souls of the people searched, not letting go of a little detail, but they couldn't find a little strange. What happened here? Qi Tian is on the Elder Cave Profound Peak Cultivation Base, how could he fall so unclearly? Everyone looked at Qi Sheng Elder who first discovered this place, hoping to hear a clue from him. At this moment, Qi Sheng looked sad, and he shook his head slightly. I don't know, it was like this when I came. Among these people, he is the closest to Qi Tian, the most painful, and the most wanting to know what happened. Everyone had no choice but to continue to search this area. Suddenly, Elder noticed not only Jin, he asked. Who of you saw Qi Yan sect leader? Two great elder is the father of Qi sect leader. How could he not come right away? The people around him were stunned by his question, and more people stopped and became worried. It may be that something hasn't been summoned. Someone said uncertainly, it is indeed possible. However, for some reason, everyone's hearts became tense. Hurry up, someone invites all sect leaders. Penalty Elder ordered that a young elder next to him took the order, turned into a rainbow, and quickly disappeared here. Soon after, the young elder flew back, sweating profusely. Oh no, he was drenched with sweat, and he didn't know whether he was nervous or tired, and he was always gasping for breath. Sect leader, disappeared, I searched the entire Tianhe sect, and the message was sent all over. He is not there. Hearing this news, a cloud of clouds fell on all elders' faces. How come, second elder couldn't talk? Because he wants to take over the destiny of the Tianhe sect, Qi Yan has been fasting safely in sect for these two days according to the rules. It's impossible to get out of the clan. Half a day later, many elders mobilized almost all of the Tianhe sect to find news of Qi Yan, but they still disappeared. In the end they had to recognize the reality, but this reality made their hearts heavy. Why, uncle died, and Qi Yan also disappeared. What is the connection between these two things? Qi Sheng griefs, the two people have a close relationship with him, but both of them are in trouble at the same time. There is a problem with this matter, anyone with a discerning eye can see it. As for the encounter with Qi Tian Taisheng Elder, I am afraid that Qi Yan. God, why is it my Tianhe sect? The old head teacher has fallen, Elder is dead, and the new sect leader is gone. Does this want me to lose sect's foundation? Second elder shouted suddenly, with a sad expression on his face. After so many years of cultivating the Tao, he really has never endured such a blow. The faces of everyone around him were equally ugly. How to do? Do you want to wake up the sleeping ancestor in the fairy tomb? Hearing this question, sect executives turned their eyes to the punishment elder. Penalty elder, in charge of the laws that determine sects' rewards and punishments, is fair and rigorous on weekdays, and is the most prestigious person in sect besides sect leader. At this moment, others clearly handed over the decision to the penalty elder. No, penalty elder said immediately, his face serious. The nine nether portal and the locking demon array both need to be guarded by the ancestors. If sect is not really facing life and death, don't disturb them. Everyone was silent. In this world, every super sect has a mission. For the safety of the world, before the last moment of sect, the ancestors must not act rashly. Then don't care about this matter. Among the elders, Qi Sheng red eyes and gritted his teeth, suddenly said. Don't look for Qi Yan. In an instant, Qi Sheng's words touched everyone. Two great elder Qishan is dead, but their sect leader is just missing. What's more, if you really don't find out one, two or three, they are the first sect of the right way, how will they have the face to meet people in the future? Everyone's eyes were directed at penal elder. How to do? How to check? They just had to say it. How to do? Penalty elder murmured. Recently, sect has encountered bad luck one after another, which has dealt a great blow to him. Seeing everyone's expectant gaze, 
he felt a heavy pressure and responsibility in his heart, and he couldn't let the sect that he had been fighting for all his life fell. There must be an explanation for this matter. His complexion became deeper and deeper, and suddenly he looked ruthless and said to everyone, Sect leader is unknown missing, and Taishang elder is dead. This matter must be investigated for the murderer to find out the truth. I will come out of the virtual mirror in three hours to explore the secret. In Kengyuan building, everyone was quiet. In a blink of an eye, they all showed shocked expressions. Please open the virtual mirror, it will come at the cost of realm's retrogression. Penalty Elder has stayed in Dongxuan's second stage for hundreds of years. If he rushes out of Dongxuan mirror, he may fall back to gold core, which is very costly. Elder, be careful, now that sect leader is missing, too, Elder has an accident. You can't have any more accidents. The other sect executives said one after another that they no longer want to see anyone injured because of it. Penalty Elder looked straight, showing a firm expression. Needless to say, I have decided, now that sect has suffered even more disasters, there are even more violent culprits who entered the Tianhe sect blatantly, killing our sect too much, Elder's life, and it was extremely rampant. For your safety, for sect's survival, I must do this. Everyone no longer dissuades him. If the murder of two elder and the murderer of sect leader's disappearance are still lurking in sect, then things will only make people shudder. They cannot bear this danger. In the next second, punishment elder's vitality exploded like a sea. He shouted righteously, his voice spreading everywhere. Tianhe sect's current penalty, elder, respectfully invite the virtual mirror of Tianhe sect's town sect. To prove the death of Taishang elder Qishan, sect leader said that he was missing. Hope the ancestor will send the edict. In the world, blue sky and white sun, layers of clouds roll over. Suddenly, there was thunder, shaking all directions. An unparalleled power suddenly descended, and the day turned dark, as if the world had changed hands. Under the thunderous sky, the punishment elder was straight, without fear. Courage is admirable. Suddenly, the sea of clouds stood still, and light leaked from the gap in it, shining on the solemn punishment elder, making it look like a god. Can, in the midair, a vast and boundless voice rang out, announcing the result. And after this voice resounded, a golden magic aimed at condensing in the sky, and unknown mysterious lines were portrayed on the magic decree. It's done, everyone realized. The elders have joyful brilliance in their eyes, and then as long as they use the decree laid down by the ancestors, they can use the virtual mirror to watch the opportunity of the world. Under the observation of the virtual mirror, the murderer must no longer be able to hide his figure. Very good. Uncle's death, the trail of Qi Yan, can have a result. In the crowd, Qi Sheng got what he wanted, looking at the punishment elder expectantly. Like him, everyone looked at the figure of punishment elder, who seemed to carry the answers to all the questions. Penalty elder took the decree that floated from the sky with both hands. This decree was designed for him, and only he could use it. Seeing the golden decree, there was shining light in his eyes. Set his mind, a large amount of vitality in the body was injected into the decree, and the golden decree began to shine with the infusion of the vitality, boundless and boundless, and a pillar of light rising into the sky. The clouds in the sky disperse, and the colorful clouds descend, dyeing the sea of clouds into auspicious colors. A bronze mirror full of ancient meaning, revealing a long-lasting breath, descended from the sky. Penalty Elder put it in his hands, the mirror surface is clear, and the mysterious Taoist rhyme spreads out. The decree left in his hand has become faint due to the triggering of the golden light beam. At this time, when the whole virtual mirror fell, this decree phantom has turned into a golden light into it in a blink of an eye. Suddenly, Penalty Elder felt a short-term special connection between him and the virtual mirror. Xie Pao he saluted to the sky. Then his realm began to decline, and Daoyun around his body became messy visible to the naked eye. The vitality in the body is irresistibly integrated into the virtual mirror. Among the crowd, someone let out a light sigh. Penalty elder is gambling. In the realm of emptiness, there is a god tier link that deduces the secrets and evolves the past and the future. It's just that this mirror is good, but it's not something that Dong Profound Realm can simply activate without paying any price. The penalty elder is betting, if the murderer this time is relatively simple, he still has the possibility of retaining realm. If not, no one knows the final result. 
Understand this reason, admiration rises in people's hearts. At the same time, a piece of emptiness in the sky, the contents of the hollow mirror projected. Penalty Elder recalled all the information about this incident in his heart, and the projection in the sky began to move. In the void, what appeared at first was a whirlpool, in which the rhyme of Taoism was mixed, and the secrets of heaven were chaotic. In just a moment, these things began to turn into a picture, but it was slightly blurred. It's the same words, someone shouted. Immediately after this person's expression changed drastically, someone was attacking their new sect leader. In the blurry picture, it can only be distinguished that there are two Taoist shadows facing each other in the midair somewhere between the mountains. One of them is exactly the figure of Qi Yan in people's impression. The other one is very unfamiliar, and the color is extremely pale, as if it were transparent. Immediately afterwards, the picture turned, and a vast ocean of blue water appeared in front of Qi Yan, as if it were boundless and immense. A sharp-eyed person immediately recognizes that this is one of Qi Yan's skills, a very profound inheritance in sect, Bihai listens to the palm of Dao. Who is it? Qi Sheng shouted in a low voice. The person who can force Qi Yan to use Bihai Ting Tao's palm must be a superb person at cultivation base. With the cultivation base of the Qian Cave profound realm, didn't it mean that the opponent could not be solved in the end? He can't wait to know the answer. The senior officials of the Tianhe sect also speculated that they did not believe that the Qi Yan of the Cave Profound Realm could not defeat the opponent with all their strength, or even escape from the opponent's subordinates. Now, Qi Yan must be unable to show up for some reason. They look forward to seeing Qi Yan's whereabouts as long as they finish watching these pictures. But, where is Qi Yan? Not far away. Punishment Elder continued to input vital energy into the whole virtual mirror, which caused his aura to become more and more bleak, and in the void of the sky, the picture continued to evolve slowly. In the chaotic scene, the intersection of heaven and earth mystery made the scene this time extremely clear. Who is it? Qi Sheng's eyes widened. The sky in the void, the figure confronting Qi Yan became clearer, and it had been condensed into a vague phantom, as if it would appear in front of everyone soon. Lianbing Mountain, Casting room. Song Wu Dao is meditating carefully, patiently waiting for the opportunity to form a gold core. There seemed to be wind surging in all directions. For no reason, Song Wu Dao felt that a line of sight appeared beside him. Um, Song Wu Dao frowned sharply. This feeling is similar to Shen Hun, but it is very different. He can only feel the existence of this kind of thing, but he can't find the source of it. This kind of seclusion slightly aroused Song Wu Dao's interest. The power of the divine soul spreads out like a tide spreading across the sky and the earth. In the Tianhe sect, all the areas were covered by him, and he easily noticed the gathering of many elders. What is this doing? Soon he noticed the objects in the hands of penalty elder. What a delicate rhyme. It seems to be related to the time and space of heaven. Song Wudao muttered to himself, this Daoyun breath is the same as the sight he perceives. And what is particularly noticeable is that this object seems to project something into the void of the sky, forming a tangled and complicated Taoist rhyme. After calming down, Song Wu Dao quietly listened to the conversations of the many elders in the field, which allowed him to gradually understand the originality of the matter. So that's it, he said. The people of the Tianhe sect are interesting. They use this method to find traces of own. Song Wu Dao thought about it for a while, and finally decided not to explain to these people. Once it was unnecessary, he might not believe it when he explained to these people. Secondly, it's not that he didn't have a way to evade everyone's detection. Taking the initiative to explain, it will only ignite the fire, making people feel that this place is infinite 300 tails, and they are increasingly suspicious of him. However, whether sect senior management can discover the truth is out of his consideration. Let things develop naturally, this is the confidence and pride that Song Wudao cultivation has already had so far. If there is a real need in the future, it will not be too late to explain. Great Tibetan Void Art In the void, the wave of power similar to the power of the soul became more and more intense, as if it was about to reach a certain limit. Perceiving this situation, Song Wudao immediately used the concealed figure technique he had signed in. With the movement of the tactics, the Daoyun aura on Song Wudao's body began to sink into a deep level, as if something was covering him, smoothing out all the fluctuations in his body. 
The power around the body resembling the power of the soul was like a fly that had lost its direction, spinning around for a long time before gathering on Song Wudao again. It wasn't enough for him to feel it, and there was very little that this force could act on him. After feeling it carefully for a while and making sure that he would not be exposed, he put the matter aside. It's a very useful thing. However, it needs to be filled with cultivation base, which is not worth the gain. Song Wudao responded to the matter just now, but if there is a real need, it would be okay. After perceiving his own situation again, Song Wudao was very satisfied. Gold Core, immediately, at the same time, under the eyes of many elders, the clearer and clearer picture of the sky in the void suddenly rippled. As the ripples passed, the people who had already begun to show up in the picture were blurred again. And the speed has never been faster. How come? In Elder, Qi Sheng lost his voice, which seemed almost incredible to him. Other elders also showed incredible looks. However, the most shocking one is the punishment elder himself used to keep the virtual mirror running and evolve the opportunity of heaven and earth with his own hands. He clearly felt that the opponent had suddenly avoided most of the probing power of the virtual mirror. The other party saw that he was investigating. Is this accidental or intentional? It's terrible, it's terrible. Penalty elder didn't dare to think about it. If it hadn't been for the ancestor's decree, he wouldn't dare to continue now for fear of causing revenge. Look, where is that? Suddenly, someone shouted, as if they had found something. In the picture, although the figure of the person facing Qi Yan becomes transparent again and loses its color, the surrounding environment clearly appears in the void. There, I feel impressed. Me too. One after another voice sounded, they all had a vague impression of this place, but they just couldn't recall where it was. Everyone speculated that this is because the place is too remote. But just like this, everyone feels an abnormal losing face. A hundred years, just a hundred years, so many important people in the door have been attacked or even killed in the door, which is too embarrassing. When did their Tianhe sect suffer such humiliation? In the sky picture, the event is still evolving. Under the attention of everyone, the person who confronted Qi Yan broke Qi Yan's tactics with a single blow. This, everyone's breathing became rapid, the heart started pounding. The opponent was defeated in one blow. You know, Qi Yan is a rare figure in Tianhe sect, who owns the cultivation base of this cave. Everyone thought carefully and was terrified. Could this person really kill the two important figures of sect with his hard power? Hiss. All elder took a breath, what a realm this person is. In the picture, Qi Yan seemed to stop saying something when he saw it, and then fled frantically. The heartstrings of the elders began to tighten as Qi Yan fled secretly prayed, hoping to escape the disaster. However, seeing the unhurried figure behind Qi Yan and chasing Qi Yan, they inevitably had a bad premonition in their hearts. If things go on like this, it's hard to escape bad luck. Among elder, Qi Sheng's eyes were red, and he swore. No matter who this person is, my Tianhe sect will kill him. Suddenly, someone exclaimed again. Look, the knife in that man's hand. This is... Senior Dao, Qi Sheng was strangled by his throat, and for a while, everyone was breathing in. Could it be that the two of Qian and his son shot the sword Saint Senior? They feel a mess. What's wrong with this world? How can anyone kill their own people? Sword Saint has been invincible since he returned to the world and has not appeared for many years. Why did he chase down the new sect leader shortly after leaving the customs? What should I do about this? Someone asked in confusion. No matter what you do, the sword saint killed a sect master, you must pay a price. Qi Sheng said angrily, his face flushed, as if he was drunk. The sword saint made a move, and he said that he was bound to die. There was silence, no one could answer this matter. Senior Dao, why do you do this? Someone puzzled. In the picture, the event is still evolving, and the chasing and killing of the people of the same words cut out with a single knife, like the galaxy cluster's knife light falling down, blooming with deadly and incomparable murderous intent. At that moment, the world was pale, and the Qi Yan who was chased seemed unbearable, anger rushed into the crown, and the body suddenly swelled between the palms of the hand, and above the body, there was a very strong black magic energy. There was an exclamation in the field. What? Impossible. Why? Qian, it's a demon. In the void picture, 
Qi Yan is huge in size, and the black magic energy around him is so powerful that he feels incomparable. However, in the field, amidst the many shocked faces of Elder, there was only silence. Even the breathing almost stopped. Devilish, the demons and monsters in this world have been raging for many years. As the elders of the first Tianhe sect of the right way, they are so knowledgeable, how could they not know this kind of thing? However, it was precisely because they recognized what it was that they were more shocked and couldn't believe it. Who would have thought that the newly appointed sect leader of the sect Tianhe sect, the most upright and upright, turned out to be a demon? This is something that everyone can hardly imagine. Such a huge devilish energy, he must cultivate the devil very deeply. How can this be? Second elder reacted, full of anger but in disbelief. No one can answer, because everyone's thoughts are the same as him, in a daze. Impossible. Among the crowd, Qi Sheng shouted. I almost grew up with him, and I never found any trace of him repairing demons. How could he suddenly be like this? This can't be true. Qi Sheng couldn't believe it, his face was extremely pale. Because of kinship, he and Qi Yan have been in contact since they were young, and they worked together at sect when they grew up. During the countless long time in the past, he never noticed anything wrong. However, this matter cannot be refuted at all. The virtual mirror reveals the secrets of heaven, and there has never been a mistake in the evolution of the past, even in the face of the Sky Master. What's more, it is a cave profound realm. This couldn't help but he didn't believe it. So suddenly his expression began to wilt, his face was like ashes, as if he had experienced a huge ordeal in a short period of time, and his body was suddenly weakened. Qi Sheng closed his eyes, knowing that a disaster was imminent. As a person who is closely related to Qi Yan, whether it is blood or life experience, he will inevitably be involved. On the other side, Penalty Elder staggered, as if he could not bear the vitality intake of the virtual mirror. After a while, he woke up. In the beginning, why did Qi Yan want to exile Ji Yu Kaishuan, but now why is it being chased by the Sword Saint Senior? It turns out that all this is because he is a demon. Together, it's a demon. And Realm is extremely high. Thinking of this, he couldn't help being afraid for a while, sweating again and again, as if he was covered with a shadow. He looked into the field, and the expressions of the other elders were filled with the same emotions. If they are truly succeeded by Qi Yan's destiny, what face will they have to see each ancestor again after the deadline, and what face will they continue to call themselves members of the Tianhe sect? It is really successful, and Tianhe sect will have endless disasters in the future. Not only Qi Yan, but the father of Qi Yan is also a demon. Penalty Elder quickly thought, otherwise, how could the Knife Saint Senior kill Qi Tian? In the void of the sky, as the mood of punishment elder, the envoy of the virtual mirror, changed, the scene of the deduction also changed. When everyone heard the punishment elder's words, their eyes immediately shifted to the sky screen, wanting to confirm the answer. Gradually, the picture at the projection site changed and began to transform into a chaotic domain, and then evolved the scene before the death of Qi Tian, the father of Qi Yan. Everyone held their breath, in the slightly dimly lit room, Qi Yan's body fell in front of Qi Yan's father, and then a nearly transparent figure holding a knife walked into it, facing the angry face of Qi Yan's father. Afterwards, the light of the sword and the magic formula reflected each other, and a huge amount of devilish energy surged. In a short moment, the father of Qi Yan fell to the ground and died under the light of the sword. The projection disappeared, and the scene was quiet for a while, but this quiet is just the peace before the storm. At first everyone was angry at the death of Qi Yan's father, and then they worried about Qi Yan's safety, but they didn't expect it. The final ending is so incredible. Earlier, they even personally sent the demon to the throne of sect leader. Many people were stunned, and immediately filled their hearts with anger, unstoppable, and unable to accept this reality. Hateful Qi Yan, hateful Qi Tian. These two things. If it weren't for the Sword Saint Senior to observe the autumn leaves, I would be in danger. Quote dot 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 quote. The verbal abuse at the two was endless. Puff. Suddenly the punishment elder spat out a big mouthful of blood, his face turned pale, he hurriedly ate a precious medicine pill. But this still couldn't stop his realm Daoyun from being scattered, and his realm aura began to decline from Dongxuan's second stage until he first entered Dongxuan, and he barely stopped the trend. Penalty. Numerous elder exclaimed, 
anxiously concerned, and then saw that Penalty Elder had begun to meditate, and they immediately calmed down and did not dare to interrupt. After a while, Penalty Elder's face was slightly ruddy, and then he waved his hand. Business matters, he ordered, come here, get Qi Sheng, Zhou Huan, and Chu Zian all arrested for me. All into the bladeless wind cliff. Quote dot 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 quote. Orders were issued, and the punishment elder endured the pain in his body to deal with the follow-up of the matter. No Blade Wind Cliff is a place where important prisoners of sector imprisoned. The people he had just read the name of are all close to Qi Yan and his son. Even if they don't know the real situation, they must be scrutinized for various reasons. And after that, basically there will be no good endings. Otherwise, there is no way to explain to others. Afterwards, many elders, in accordance with the punishment elders' orders, began to capture the people who were called out. But I don't know when they started, these people had realized that something was wrong, they restrained their breath and wanted to escape quietly. However, the French Open is restoring and not leaking. In the end, several people were still captured and handed over to the corresponding department of sect to escort several people to where they should go. At this time, another problem began to emerge. Among the many elders, someone looked solemn and asked, Since Qi Yan is dead, who should be the sect sect leader now? Elder was embarrassed. The country cannot be ruled for a day, and the position of the sect leader of the Tianhe sect cannot be left in the air, otherwise, sooner or later, big problems will arise. However, the position of sect leader, in addition to requiring the realm itself to be sufficiently superb, must also be able to convince all parties. Otherwise, people of the same family will have suspicions for each other, which is also a big disaster. People flashed in their hearts, but they couldn't satisfy them. In sect, the old sect leader died and the new sect leader became a demon. There is no one who can take on this important task. Punishment elder is willing. Someone recommended that although the penalty elder was too old, after the incident, the prestige of the penalty elder became even heavier, and he could be convinced on stage. Therefore, everyone looked at the punishment elder, meaning it was self-evident. Penalty elder shook his head and refused, saying, My cultivation base is unstable, I need a long time for closed-door training to stabilize the cultivation base, and I can't spend so much time. Besides, I'm not far from the end, and I am not suitable for this important task. When everyone saw this, it was hard to persuade them, so they could only think about the names of sect talents one after another. At this moment, in the silence, someone suddenly suggested. Then, please come to the knife Saint Senior. No one in sect can hold the position of sect leader right now. It's better to let the knife Saint Senior temporarily preside over the overall situation. It is not impossible to succeed when someone can meet the conditions in the future. Under everyone's attention, the proposer explained. This time the knife Saint Senior can take the initiative to help. I won't just watch the sect leader in the door, and sect will stop. Invite the knife saint senior to serve for a period of time, it may not be unsuccessful. Everyone nodded, and this sentence was recognized by most people. Only then, penalty elder shook his head again. This thing will not succeed. Everyone turned their eyes to him. Senior Zijing, you didn't know how many masters seniors killed in order to be quiet at the closed door training. This time the senior was seen by us but did not show up for a long time. It is already very clear. Besides, if something like this happens, why are we embarrassed to ask this senior to do more? Everyone's complexion darkened, and the words made sense. Sect has become this bleak look now, even if they don't have to bear all the responsibilities, they will definitely not be able to escape them. Do they have any face to see this senior again now, and then lick their faces to ask for help? The court fell silent again, and finally, penalty elder showed a helpless expression. Let Kaishuan come. That way I can take care of it a bit too. Everyone had different expressions, but in the end they turned into bitter smiles. In sect, there was no more suitable person than Ju Kaishuan for the time being. However, Ju Kaishuan was born with a strong body, and the speed of cultivation, the high combat power, among the geniuses of the past, are very outstanding. Coupled with the identity of Gu's sect leader's granddaughter, becoming a sect leader can be said of the past. Can, so be it. Quote dot 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 quote. Finally, under the recommendation of the penalty elder, Ju Kaishuan was appointed as the current sect leader of the Tianhe sect.
and this is also realm's lowest sect leader since the creation of the Tianhe sect. This is enough to show that Tianhe sect has fallen into an extremely weak situation at this moment. In fact, in recent years, the weakness of the Tianhe sect has been foreshadowed, and this is not only because of sect leader and Qi Yan father and son. What's more, it is somehow that some of the masters in the door have fallen down one after another. So the current situation seems to be an inevitable result. Some people sighed that the world was unpredictable. They had known this before, and they directly followed the penalty of Elder's recommendation and let Ji Yu Kaishuan become the sect leader. It also saves this twists and turns. Six months later, Ji Yu Kaishuan returned to the Tianhe sect and officially became the sect leader of the Tianhe sect at the sect leader coronation ceremony. At this time, other big forces that closely followed the movements of the Tianhe sect because the position of the sect leader was suspended, after taking over the news, couldn't help but let out a ridicule. They sighed that there is no one in the Tianhe sect, and now they need a little girl to take on the responsibility of sect leader. After this day, the news of the deteriorating Tianhe sect spread like wildfire, and the less and less participation of the Tianhe sect in major events in the world also provided proof of the authenticity of this news. The decline of Tianhe sect has become a fact recognized by most people. Time flies, 280 years have passed. One day, on a path close to Lianbing Mountain, Ji Yu Kaishuan climbed up the path, immersed in the feeling of nostalgic for her old friend. The green grass is more lush than it was 300 years ago. Recalling the 280 years back to sect. From the moment she was picked up by sect's people, his master told her seriously about sect's situation at that time. After learning that sect was abnormally weak, she chose to retreat for the career her grandfather used to fight for, and also for the sect she grew up with. Retreat from the dead, unless you reach the goal, she will never go out, and her goal is to be promoted to the gold core realm. But in a blink of an eye, I don't know how many years have passed, and she hasn't been able to come to Refining Soldier Mountain. It wasn't until a few days ago that she entered the Bilawodion and broke into the Gold Core Realm in one fell swoop. Her closed-door training really ended and she got a chance to relax. It was only here that she really settled her mind, and had time to come to the Lianbing Mountain to look for the remaining traces of Song Wudao, miss the easy and happy days of the past. In her opinion, with Qin Feng's aptitude and the identity of a disabled person, it is not an ordinary difficulty to be promoted to the next realm. By this time, he was about to have passed away. Thinking of this, her heart gradually filled with sadness. Walking all the way, Ji Yu Kaishuan was not fast, but she still quickly entered the category of refining soldier mountain. Unexpectedly, the first time I left, I didn't even see your last side. When she retired in order to climb realm, she gradually realized that the time when she got along with Song Wudao was a free and beautiful time. At that time, her relatives had not passed away, and she had a lot of time to do whatever she wanted. Wu Yu and Carefree. Only later, 280 years have passed. In this world, most people and things have long been completely unrecognizable. Walking into the casting room where the two most often met, Ji Yu Kaishuan looked at the earth fire burning here. Nearly 300 years have passed. The owner here has died, but the flames are still burning. Unfortunately, these things are no longer useful. Her eye circles were red, and there was a faint mist in her eyes, but she closed her mouth and didn't let the tears fall. She still has a very important cultivation task unfinished, and she is afraid that her weakness at this time will affect her subsequent cultivation state. After stopping for a while, Ji Yu Kaishuan was about to leave. From then on, she will continue to bear the burden of the sect leader of the Tianhe sect. I am afraid it will be difficult to come here again. What happened to you? Suddenly, a voice that seemed to be auditory hallucination appeared around Ji Yu Kaishuan. Her figure stopped, her beautiful face seemed to be frozen. Are you sad? Song Wudao asked inexplicably. Opposite, Ji Yu Kaishuan came over slowly, asking herself in her heart. The voice in front of me, is it true? She pinched the flesh on her arm, and there was a trace of pain. She immediately turned her head, and in the distance, a young man with simple clothes, as in the past, stood quietly. Although his eyes were closed, it seemed that he would not be affected. The young man looked at himself with a slightly concerned smile on his face. Are you, still alive? Ji Yu Kaishuan was stunned, and then said. 
I'm alive naturally, and I'm alive well. The youth's voice sounded. Ji Yu Kaishuan's eyes became wet again, her vision became blurred, and a tear slipped down. Just stay alive. She seemed to sigh with emotion and said with a smile. At this moment, nothing can make her more happy than meeting old friends. How could I die? Song Wudao said, with some doubts about Ji Yu Kaishuan's performance. Why is she sad, herself? But he didn't have any extra questions. At times like this, as long as a friend is quietly company, most of the problems can be solved. After a while, Ji Yu Kaishuan's vision became clear, and she finally had time to observe Song Wudao in front of her. The appearance of the young man in front of him is no different from the past, the Daoyun is real and restrained, and there is nothing wrong with it. When did you succeed in foundation building? Then the two found a place to rest, and Ji Yu Kaishuan began to ask, like an old friend recounting the past. Song Wudao thought for a while and replied, More than 300, nearly 400 years ago. Ji Yu Kaishuan was taken aback. I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.